Microphone check. Microphone check. Hey, Mark. Desk check. cam check. Hey, Chris Jackson. Chris Jackson, I forgot to turn the lights on check. Oh, yeah. Chris Jackson. It's dark in here. I kind of Thanks like so it. much for coming in. It's dark like in it here. It's dark. Uh, let's see. Kitchen cam two check. Happy Monday, Dutchman. Double kitchen check. Kitchen check. Triple oh, check. Oh, yeah. It might four be frozen, four but check. it's working all right. Dog cam check. Whoop, whoop. Happy Monday, everybody. It's all right, but it's working good. Let's do four. Let's do four. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Great to see you, Stu Port. Thanks so much for coming in, Dutchman. Chris Jackson. Strut it on in here. We strut. We strut. John Suno. Hello. Okay, fine. I'll do one one on the house. One on the it house, is Dutchman. It's 420, Co. Just one. One on the house. Here we go. I need to start remembering to wear white so you can see Chloe. I gotta start remembering to turn lights on. Yeah. Wait, we don't turn the light on in here usually. Oh, no, these lights. Oh, your green lights. Your green lights. Gotta have the green lights for the ambiance. The ambiance. Kathy H is here. Hi, Kathy, Kathy H. Kathy H. In the house. Thanks for coming in. John Sooner, great to see you. We love you guys. It's Monday. It's Monday. How'd that happen again already? Like, I can't whoa. even believe it. I got to spin whoa. the wheel. And now? Boop, boop. And now? We're going to go backpacking tomorrow. With no further ado. Wheel spin. Spin the wheel. Spin, spin the, the wheel. wheel. Spin, spin the wheel. wheel. Spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. Fake snow gummies. Yeah. Fake snow gummies. Big fake snow gummies. Let's get I'm this party started. Right. I'm not doing it. She's not doing it. I was all it. I was foggy as hell the whole next day the last time I smoked a joint. She joy. ain't doing it. She ain't doing it. I gotta be tip top tomorrow. We're gonna hike as far as we can. We're gonna we're gonna put on the miles. We're gonna put on some big miles tomorrow. We're gonna put on so many miles. Oh, uh, thanks, Kathy. Ooh. We are. Yeah, we don't even have smoke. We're looking real good. I mean, it's been an amazing year. It's been cool and smokeless, though now it's hot. It's like 105 degrees outside right now. It's so hot. Uh, but up on the mountain, it's only supposed to be low 80s. So it'll be nice. And it's supposed to be like 50s at night. And there's supposed to be an amazing meteor shower with, a, with not much moon. So we're excited. We're looking forward to it. Joint to scare away the skeeters. Hey. Rob Q. I like the way you Americans here. Rob Q. Hey. Goldie Cobb. Goldie Cobb's here. Hey, Goldie Cobb. 108. Greetings. Holy macaroni. What are we sitting at? What are we Dang. sitting at? Dang. 108. It said the high was supposed to be 105. We went and picked heirloom tomatoes. We're going to make BLTs. Spoiler alert. 101 down here, Goldie oh, yeah. Cobb. 101. And it was 80 when we left the house at like 10 o'clock. And it was 86 by the time we got back like an hour later. William's in the house. Hey, William. Rob Q, free bird. Let's check out the southern, wait, no, the Bluebells. This one's called Bluebells. Bluebells. Should we check it out? Yeah. Check it out a little bit. Oh boy. Shiny. This is what we're gonna roll up into a doobie. Are you ready for this? You better just that focus a little bit. That's a little fresher than what we're usually scoping. Holy macaroni, look at all those trichomes. Holy, holy. Cloudy with a hint of amber, as Teddy Spaghetti said. Yeah. Eight. 81 at night. Dang. That's too hot. That's Is that too in much. Arizona? Is that Dutchman? No. Uh, Goldie. Wow, really? Goldie, that's too much. I think we're still getting down into the Hey, 60s. that's you guys. Look at you guys. I'm on top chat. Yeah, what a new. tasty trichomes. What a new. Someday. Goldie, we should meet up for a hike or something. Hey. We could just meet up somewhere and go on a little hikey hike. Speaking of meeting up for a, a hike. A little, hike. like, flat one. We met up with Wheat and Shaw, and you guys haven't seen us since we did that. Oh, that's true. 
we're gonna premiere it not this Wednesday, but next Wednesday. We had so much fun. He is a freaking who, just as you'd expect. If uh, you guys are not subbed to Weekend Shaw, maybe JoJo could share his link. It was so fun just going out on the trail and being silly, silly frickers. So silly frickers. We so silly yeah, frickers we're getting down there, to Dutchman. like our high, our highest low is on Wednesday, and it's 71. We're like. In the 60s for Lowe's, mostly. John Ryan in the house. Okay, let me get to Wheaton Well, Shots. thanks so much for coming in. Hope you all had a wonderful weekend. Uh, hope you're having a great Monday. Yankee Kyle, good evening, fine sir. Great to see you. We are doing a, a short uh, desktop stream tonight so that we can get ready for our... We're waking up at 4 in the morning to try to get as much hiking in before the heat of the day. We're going to try to go as far as possible for our little bodies. We're going to try to push our bodies to their <laughs> max. Not to their max. We're just gonna to push, where we feel comfortable. We're just going to push our bodies right <laughs> to the brink. We're not doing it to that. But we are going to go. We're, we're hoping, like, our goal is to do more than 10 miles the first day and then about, you know, 9 or 10 way. the second day. Like way. That's, that's way beyond my brink. Uh, we talked about it. Or if we go back, then we would have to remember we talked about maybe, 13 the first maybe day we'll and 7 talk, on maybe the way we'll, back. Maybe we'll, we'll show you guys. Maybe we'll talk about it some more. We'll show you guys exactly what we're thinking. But oh. it, it's a hike that we're going to do in opposite order. So in September, we have planned a two-night, three-day hike with Silly Sally Sumac Tree and another friend you guys haven't met. And we're going to go from Timberline Lodge to Cloudcap. So we're doing recon going uh, from Timberline forward and from Cloudcap back before that happens so we can have the inside intel on the hike before we go all three days. What's Cheers, happening? everyone. Damn, she's at 13 miles. Damn. Doug, yeah. Doug, check out Dougie Doug's channel, yeah. Yeah. Uh, if you if you want to share that link too, please do. He's yeah. on the road. Do it, do it, Dutchman. Um, yeah, we love Dougie Doug. He's just always so cool and laid back and awesome. Yeah, Goldie. So that's that only if we movie. end up wanting to wanting to uh, have less to do the next day. But I feel like it's it's probably as much as it is. And for us, we have this serious tendency to want to set ourselves up to have an easier day the next day. But I feel like sometimes you know I've been talking to other backpackers and stuff, and sometimes that can shoot you in the foot because you. Even though you have less to do, you really overexerted yourself the day before. And when we do our three-day hike, we're going to do, you know, 10, 10, and 7, I think. So we will have less the last day, but we're not going to go crazy on any day. Love you, Stuport. Thank you so much for coming in and for the positive vibes. We are going to ride those vibes all the way. Oh, dang, to our yeah. Banks. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Hope you get some relaxing in. Hello. You know we're going to be strutting. Cheers. Baltimore Brian! Baltimore Hello. Brian! Fire the green! Fire it up! Fire it up! Fire! 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 Sad impressive elephant riders reference. Ah. For Clutch? Yeah. Man. He's a, he's a fan. He introduced me to him. I haven't kept up. Music... My listening to music has fallen off with Cryptic's age. burning too. He's a doobie smoker. You know it. Hey, Cryptic. We know it. Baltimore B, Cryptic. Yankee Kyle's going to be at 800 soon. Everybody Man. jump on Yan Yankee Kyle if you want to drop your not, link. If you're not, yeah. just click right on there. You can click right on there. But always feel free. Anybody can feel free to drop their link. We're everybody drop everybody's links. Yep. Oh, Cryptic. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Man, she, it was hard. She was like, oh, man, she was our baby. What, one of so the much. things when you start streaming that you're not thinking of is like, oh, my dog's part of the show, and then it's yeah. part of the whole thing, and man, yeah, it's, I mean, but it's it hard But it's great no to have what, the community to experience with it with, you know, yeah. and just like, yeah. 
it's it was nice. It's I feel like it's better than you know the more people that you have to kind of share and express the love that you had for for your your loved ones, whether they be people or animals, the better I think. Goldie, uh, I had a friend who was a really big fan of him, like like a fan back in. 2001 and we volunteered at a festival that they were playing at so we got to go see them and we had like you know more access passes so we were behind the gate as they came off of the stage after their thing and my <laughs> my buddy who was a big fan went up shook the lead singer's hand he's like I've always wanted to meet you and the guy looked down and he's like now you have <laughs> <laughs> and just cruised off. <laughs> it's like one of my favorite celebrity moments. You did it. <laughs> Way to go, bud. <laughs> you blew your shot. <laughs> oh man, we got our first heirloom tomatoes today. We went and picked them right off the freaking plants. This morning. Are they right there? No. There's, there's some, I put them in the fridge. There's some heirloom Ooh, cherries in the corner. Those are purple cherry tomatoes. They're called, I can't remember, but I got them in like kind of various stages to show them off. They show get, them off. So they're purple and they're supposed to have more antioxidant. Are we seeing them? Yeah. They're supposed to have more antioxidants closer. than others. But like that one's not quite like it feels pretty good. I think it'll be delicious. But then that one's pretty ripe, and see, almost all the purple's gone. It's got a little bit of a butt crack on that side, a little stripy purple butt crack. But yeah, they're so fun that I had to get a few, even though we have cherry tomatoes. Purple tomatoes. I've seen purple heirlooms, but I didn't. I don't think Sad said he's seen purple. Um, Officer Lauren. What? Lauren's here? What? This is the heirloom tomato we're going to use for our BLTs right here. Officer Lauren. Officer Lauren's here. We're so excited, Lauren. Great to see you. Yeah. I love butt crack tomatoes. We found some butt crack berries with wheat and shah. It's true. <laughs> um, and it made me reference uh, Cool Runnings. Because JoJo was calling them butt crack berries, and I said, How about I draw a line down your face and call you a butt crack? It's true. It's deep cut. Can confirm, can confirm. Deep cut. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. Moistinator. Moist. Man, Lauren, I'm doing great. How are you? It's just really great. It's so funny. I kind of feel like I summoned you Lauren because I was <laughs> thinking about you today I was literally I was in there chopping up watermelon and was like we haven't seen Lauren in a while I sure do hope she's doing great it's really really awesome to see you should I give them a sneak peek of moistness yeah I just, was kind of just thinking a that random too. a random just do a random Thing. Yeah, whatever. No, that's just this. Butt crack, those aren't the butt crap berries. Those aren't butt crap berries. Butt crap berries. Are you from? Oh. Why does it do that sometimes? Oh, thanks, Lauren. We're so happy to see you. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. Wait, I want the I want the one where we're all making the Chloe face. I was doing a bad job of making Chloe face in that one. What was I doing? Just smiling. Find the Chloe face one. <laughs> that one's close. Go one more back. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I was like, everybody make Chloe face. <laughs> Moist. She was making a funny face right then. 
You are nailing the Chloe face, sweet. Welcome, we. And Sha. I wonder if I can remember how to play she It's been so long since I played She Loves You because I haven't seen Lauren in so long. Did you say hello to Wheat? Wheat? Hi, Wheat! And Sha. Wednesday's Huckleberry episode. Next Wednesday is Moistmas. 
yes. with wheat and shawl. Yep, and yep, Chloe and Chloe and wheat lick wait. the same plate together. Oh no! At the same time. Oh no! Spoiler alert! You just dropped. You just gave away the whole the whole plot. It was twist. the best part of the episode. It was like the M Night Shyamalan part. Yeah. At the end, it was the. It's true. So don't tell anybody. It's our little secret. Don't tell anybody. I think there aren't very many people in here to give away our secret. Yeah. You people be quiet. <laughs> Oh man, I'm excited for BLTs. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah, we got a lot of good stuff. It's gonna be hard to trim it down to an hour, I feel like. So much good footage. So much good stuff. We never did do Pickathon. But we've heard it talked up as well. Yeah, I would. Um, I feel like I feel like it's for grown-up hippies. And when I was really, when we were really investing in uh, entertainment, we were more going to the the younger hippie. Like I feel like it's it's refined. I feel, I feel like Pickathon has a refined lineup, which brings a refined group of folks. Where we were looking more for the late night. <laughs> if you know yeah, what I mean. It's true. We really were. If you know what I mean. We got all that out of our system. Right, quick. Lindsay <laughs> likes to lick plates too. Yeah. Have we spun the wheel yet? We have spun it once, and that was on the house. So they say. For 420. And so, then every 10 likes. We got another spin coming in. Oh, what? Time to spin the wheel. Spin, spin the, the wheel. wheel. Spin, spin the, the wheel. wheel. No gummies. Big face, no gummies. Big face, no gummies. Breathing a sigh of relief over gravity bong. <laughs> yeah, but we wouldn't even be up for the late night. Now, if like a band we really wanted to see was playing the late night, we'd be like, oh, we're gonna probably miss that. <laughs> but we just haven't, I don't know, I guess we'd, we, not to say we're over going to shows, because I do feel like I would still, but. I love, every once in a while we stream a live show and just kind of dance in our living room and just going out in nature and like we're just super into backpacking. That's kind of what we want to do with our weekendsies these days. Weekendsies. And we don't have to take, because it, you know, well that's not true. I was going to say a lot of the live music is on weekends and a lot of it is, but you can still find good shows on any day of the week. Show's over. That's right, Glincy. He said, oh crap, Gravity Bomb. Show's over now. Thank you. Glincy, I don't know uh, if you saw the title. We are doing a little shorty tonight because we got to get up at 4. JoJo wants to get up at 4 a.m. Yeah, because That's it's, four supposed, it's in the to morning. Be hot. It'll feel so nice to get out on the trail early. Oh, we can I, finish, I'm so happy about the decision. We can finish our day, you know, finish our day of hiking by 4. And Speaking of that. Just siesta for the hot part of the day. Find a nice shady spot, drink our filtered water, which we which we tested our filters. After uh, after this nonsense, we should check out the hike. Yeah, we'll check out the hike next. When hey, Ingles. Ingles in the house. Ingles is here. Shout out, Ingles. Hope. If you guys aren't subbed up on Ingles too, hope the whole you, pack's doing good. If you're just feeling bored, yeah, and you know you feel like chatting with people, he's like mostly always on, and there's mostly always someone in there to just like check out the yard, and it's cool to see you know the different seasons of the yard. I love it when it's so snowy, the like puppies. just popping in there once in a while. Sub up and for the puppies. The puppies. Meets. Oh gosh, those dang puppies, so cute. Big puppies. They're big for puppies. She so is only like this big when she was a puppy. Shed Gang's here! Just in time for the gravity bomb, Shed Gang. The mold's killing them. Dang Everybody it. check yeah. out the community post if you uh, are looking for someone to help out a little bit this month. Uh, Shed Gang is looking for a little bit of help. Shout out to everyone who's already uh, lended some 
some effort in that direction. Yeah. We love you all. We want we want our friends to be in safe, sound living conditions for sure. And that's not what's happening right now. Glenn wants to get a close up of the picture on the wall with us standing on the mountain. So the that is yeah the blanket or tap what do, what would you call that? The we uh, can't really do a close up, but we do have like that picture. We could bring the fat one of us close. Yeah, the one of us being. Oh no, but we could find the picture maybe. Yeah. Or no, it's on the other drive at this point. Um, we could go to the VOD. Huh? Oh yeah, the wait. The VOD. Oh, or but the, that doesn't the video. show us like that. Wait, is that that's that not does. on my phone? It's on your phone. You don't I have it know. on your phone anymore. Oh, she thinks the tomato went bad. Hi, Charles Richardson. Charles Richardson! <laughs> okay, Lauren, we'll make sure and get a good... We got lots of tomatoes. I'm sure that there's one in there that's good. Cheers, everybody. Great to see you, Charles Richardson. Don't do this at home. So we have the one... I don't know if we've ever shown it to you guys. Probably at some point, but... Oh, that's thick. Oh, 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 oh. And not, like, with two Cs. That's, like, with the CK... Chloe's got her eye on that. So we have, hey, Robot Envy. Cheers. Look at him holding in that thing. I would be coughing up a lung immediately. So this was the first one they got. I guess it would be called a throw. And it made us extra wide. Us in the mountain and everything extra wide. So then the one that we hung on the wall. My way. Oh, yeah. The one we hung on the wall is regular us's. That's us like seven we're years short, ago. We're short and fat in the, that We look maybe, shorter too. Maybe not JoJo. Yeah, me. Yeah. Except I was not any shorter than I am now. Oh, yeah. Maybe. But yeah, it was such a great gift. Sad's parents are so, uh, so awesome. And it's so funny, we showed... Uh, my nephew was over and he was like, I love that. And we showed him the other one and he was like, oh, that one's, that one would be my favorite if it was me. <laughs> he likes the Hobbit version. Um, but let's, I, I do kind of want to, we could. Who is who? <laughs> I'm going to play her for Halloween. Just kidding. Unfortunately, Dutchman, I didn't get, I, I was too distracted to get that one on film. <laughs> How long ago was that? And what it, we were call, we call stuff so such random stuff. No, not not on the videos. Wait, it was alive, wasn't it? No, here, take here. Oh, we did do we try to do a quick live right there. there. We did do a quick live at the top. This was like the, our first big like lots of elevation hike now we do a hike like this that has a thousand feet of elevation in a mile and it's just like <coughs> easy you know pretty easy i mean not you know you're still breathing hard but it's like this was hard like, my legs hurt it's so crazy how far you can come when you just put your mind and your body to it windows oh Oh, I don't want to see him, I bet. Yeah, no. Let's see him, though. I don't want to uh, see him, let's see him. I don't, <laughs> don't want to see him, let's see him. The stump dance video? Oh, my God. Do you mean the... Are you talking about the... Oh, race? no. The fuck? Are you talking about the one where he's humping the... The fuck? The rock? What's the stump dance? That can't be legal. <laughs> yeah, it's not. That is crazy. Don't strike my channel. Are you like stuffed up all the time or what? Yeah. That sad would be. He, we cannot live in I a mean, place that's that has beyond, dust and mold. Like, yeah. Like, Period. Here, but. Here's the man. Man, I wish, I wonder if that picture is in my pictures. That's horrible shit. I, I, I can't. It makes me angry 
is like the, the, the number one emotion I have. Yeah, um, I hope you can get freaking out of there. Yeah. Gosh, man, like that. Was that August of last year? No, maybe earlier July. Yeah, here it is. Oh, I have them. I have them. I could send it over. I should send the one send where you're looking right. like Peter Pan. I am going to. Send it right over. Okay. Share. Bluetooth. Select a device. Bada boom, bada boom. Desktop. Thanks for coming this in and hanging is a, out, everybody. Yeah. yeah damn shit. This one's a behind the scenes. Chris, yeah. I should send over. Oh, I want to send the one where I'm like grabbing the mountain, too. so many good ones from that. I, you know, it's funny because I have been kind of feeling like I need to start taking more pictures because I'm only taking videos for YouTube, you know, but it's really nice to have just the pictures. Uh, feel free to drop your, your info. Also. Oh, Lauren wants you to listen to her. What'd oh, she what say? did I miss? What'd she even say? The tomato's not good. We saw that. That's the last thing you said, Lauren, that we can see. Are we on top chat? No. Oh, whoa. Anytime you type something, we're going to pay attention to it. Yeah, we got you. We won't slice that tomato. We'll get it. We'll pick a different one. We'll pick a better one. Oh yeah, one. the rock pumping video. Yeah, that thing's amazing. I like the, the I, I kind of want to share that one too. Yeah. Uh, you look like you're having such a hard time there. I was having a hard time. I was climbing to the top of the mountain. I was free climbing. What am I doing? Uh, everything got confusing. I think it was the, the gravity bomb. Yeah, it's the maybe. gravity bomb here. Yeah. The, the the sad Peter Pan version of that picture. The one we didn't uh, publify. Excuse me? Publify, you know. That's a word. Beg, beg my pardon? That's a good word. It's a good word I made up. There we are. Huzzah! Huzzah! So, the, the behind the scenes of this story, or this shot, is sad on one part of a peak, putting a camera down, and having 15 seconds, I think it was, to jump a little gap up to this part of the peak and get in position for the photo. It was, it was entertaining. We should have documented that with enough. If we would have, we should have. We didn't. Next time. Next time. I want to give. I want to send a few over that are hilarious. Okay. Was there another one already? Uh. Oh, I got. No, I, I can't. Gotta, I gotta yeah. make it be. I gotta make it be. Let me make it be 101 degrees, folks. It's hot. Fimbo's wondering, it's hot. And we're going to the mountain tomorrow. So yeah, where it'll be a little less hot. It'll be less hot, a little bit. Like, only 20 degrees less hot. But we are closer to the sun, so it'll probably feel a little hotter. I'm going to be running from shade to shade. We had huckleberry pancakes again this morning. Oh, they were so good. I was like, um... We lost a chat. We need a chat here. What are we going to have for breakfast? Hmm. Let's do the same thing we did last week, pretty much. Brent Battle Cam's in the house. Hey, Brent Battle Cam. That's, that's kind of how I feel. <clears throat> oh, thanks, guys. Yeah, that... I mean, that is such... I really want to go back up there <coughs> one of these days. It was one of the most amazing 
I sorry. ending spots. Yeah. I I would actually give it my top five hikes I've ever been on. Like just because of everything. And it's so nice and shady and, and woodsy beforehand, and then when you get up, it's just like kind of this small space that's this wonderful little peak and you can just see everything. Sal's got those baby birthing hips. You know it, Chris Jackson. Hell right. Devige is here. Hell Hello, right. Devige. Dear to peers. Everybody thrown down on a Monday night. Somewhere in, in America. America. Bottle of bud and firelight. Hell right. And then all the mechanics here too. I got them birthing hips. People are just dropping in on Sal's birthing hips. Everybody catch a little ride on them them sweet hips. <laughs> I don't know why they called me the gay Tupac. <laughs> Who was that? I don't know. Oh man, somebody on, on Kill Tony and killed it with that one. I was like, Look me, Tupac. What? What? What happened? The Powerball lottery and the stolen loan secret society manipulation of my life. Brett Battlecamp wants us to share his oh. 15 second short. Yeah. No, yeah, definitely. Yeah, do it. Do it! Please feel free to drop any links to any of your channels. You um, could show it, right? Please. We could show it if Brent Baucan doesn't care. I don't care. Yeah, post it. We'll watch it right now. We'll, we'll it show right. it to everybody and, and then everybody, everybody can on. watch it. Robert's right along! Hi, Robert's right along! That's us on... So I was going to say top ten. Did I say top ten? Top 10 hikes. Um, it's a short distance. There's a lot of like risk reward feel, but it's super safe. You know what I mean? Like there is a little bit of scramble. It's it, you know if you feel like you're doing something a little bit at the end. If you go like, all the way to the peak, which you don't have to, and you still are very much like peaked, you still have the same view. You we're know? peaking. So you don't have to do that, but there's still like a slight scramble to get up but it was like my legs were tired and stuff because we just hadn't done much of it before that now it would just be a little like walk in the park it would be so amazing and then to I we really wanted to we left the dogs at home because I don't remember oh because of the scrambles we were worried we wouldn't be able to get them up and I wanted to stay there all day we were just like in love yeah. with that place. Yeah, we would have stayed for sunset, I think, it's if the dogs wouldn't have been at home. Sleeping Beauty in the Gifford Pinchot. Yeah, it's only a two mile, like 2.2 miles or something. I love that picture. He's climbing that on those uh, burls. That was my first day, I think. Like you wore those shoes? One of my first days I wore those shoes. Yep. And I was like, mm, so they might, a new pair. You've had them for a year They now. might be a little squishy. And but then I fell in love with them after a year. Did Whereas you, oh, the you first didn't send the other one? Or did I you? did. Okay, maybe I need to refresh this. The first time I wore my Solomons, I was like, oh, yes, these are the shoes I will wear the rest of my life. The first time. I've never had a break-in issue with Solomons. They're so great. What the heck? Oh, there it is. Uh. <laughs> I swear. He was hanging for his dear life uh, by a cliff edge rock. In one of the pictures I showed where his feet were on the ground accidentally. Oh. <laughs> I gave you away, I gave it away. There's, there should be, I Smoke thought I did mirrors. one more. Smoking mirrors. Maybe not. Is well, I, I, got, I got another one. Oh, okay. Don't take this. Where are you going? Did you show my, the one where I'm touching the mountain? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was birthing my eggs. Yeah, is that what was going on there? Yeah, they were coming out of my cloaca. <laughs> he was cloacaing eggs. You just missed him. Ah, good one. You just missed him. And then I had to run away because once my eggs hatch, they try to eat me. It's the opposite problem of most oh, things. Click on, let's watch Brent's uh, shorts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get it up 
here and your fine nephew Briab for president is here. Rob Briab for president. Everybody, vote Briab for president. It's muted. That bust like elephant guns and long magazines. I shine, illuminate. Yeah, my aura is all. Okay, hold on. I missed it. A universal citation? What the frick? What, is, what does it mean? They want you to keep them all. You have, you have to collect them all. Uh, we saying that he collects rocks and loves to swim makes me want to show you guys my piece of the petrified redwood. Oh, it made me also want to show you something else. That is crazy, Brent. That is crazy. Brent. I, I, I will definitely look into that farther and I'll share it on our community page. Oh yeah. Wheaton Shaw's artwork. It is amazing. Everybody check out Wheaton Shaw's page. Look at this. It's a rock wood. It's wood rock. She loves rocks. I especially love wood rocks. Wood rock. Wood rock. Look, it's really like it's rock rock on that side. I love big ass trees. Yeah, me too, Goldie. Like it was so that. funny. I can't believe we've never thought to call Chloe Cloaca before. Cloaca before. Oh, well, let me do a community post. That's weird. Is what only in California? That thing. The we just recently did our first ticket too, Brent. It was the first one. Oh, that, that rule. Uh, we streamed it and stuff. That was our first and the, the last one we did. We haven't done it since. What Robert was that? loves his rocks too. His geode mining video came out the other day. We we're opening them live on Saturday, and we'll auction them off. Also, that's exciting. Heck yeah! And California has a penal code three twenty two about rigging the lottery. Three two two is skull and bones. I didn't even know that. Yeah, I didn't know that either. But yeah, that's going to get suppressed for sure. Uh, it, uh, huh. I will uh, share it on our community page though. I'll help you get the word out because that's crazy. I should, we should show them that picture. Did, we, have, did you see the picture of the Redwood? Uh, we did it on a, well we did it on a VOD, but I think I also have pictures. Oh. Did you finish off the buddies? I think you did, right? Ugh. Tell them what you're taking on the trail. We just got something new today. Ugh. Uh, uh, one second. Okay, I'm gonna see about this. Can't type what? Redwood picture. So, I still have not. I'm a slacker, Robert. I'm sorry. I'd like. If it were an audiobook, I'd have definitely listened to it. I listen to a lot of audiobooks now while I work. And I basically work and sleep and hike. Um. OK, 
camera to share this redwood picture. We have the bond of that. Oh, yeah. Okay. You can just look at it. That's a good idea. What's the date? Do you know? uh, May 2nd. That was the coolest. I want to go back there. It's funny, you know, there are just so many great places and you always want to go back and then you just go keep going to new places. Just when you were about to turn your ass. Oh my god, we found it. Just when you think all hope is lost. Just when you were about to turn your ass around. Oh, what the freak is that? Oh my god, it's freaking awesome. Oh, that is cool. And we went at just the right time. Yeah, for, it, there's water leaking through it for reference. Nobody goes there. Nobody knows about it. It's like right by the town my sister lives in. She had no idea about it. I, it, there is very little about it on the internet. It's our secret. Don't tell all you people face. out there in chat. Oh, there is a face. It looks like it has a funny little beak thing. Or there's probably multiple faces. There's like a warthog face up there. Oh, nice, Goldie. Glen Auto Park. Glen Auto. That sounds cool, though. Is that the one over by, like, Troutdale? Is that one that we went to? Glen Auto Park. That's cool. That sounds familiar. I can't place it. Is it, like, an off-leash dog park? Yeah, over by Troutdale East of Gresham. I think that might be the one we went to. I, it's the one on the other side, I think. Yeah. So if you go to where we went, if you go towards Gresham, under the river, or under the bridge, same one. Yeah, it is a secret to pure place, Kathy. Super secret to Which pure. mom's from Troutdale. Whoa! I wonder if you, that's like a real statement, or it if you're like... Could be true. So, Dill Hole! Dill Hole! Dill Hole! Great to see you. Great to see you, Dill Hole. We're, we're doing a short PC at home stream so that we can go to bed early and wake up at 4 in the morning to go do this hike. Let's call it the Tree Pier Rock, since it's a tree and a rock both. Tree Pier Rock. Here, it's this hike. Oh, nice. I meant to hit this button, silly. The one and only. The one and It's free, not a state park. We have all the passes, so... Uh, the free doesn't really matter so much. But some of them do charge regardless... But it's good to know. ...of your passes. Yeah. This? We should go there. We can let Chloe meet Kona. Yeah, that would be awesome. This is where we're going to start our hike at Cloud Cap, the historic uh, inn where they start a lot of mountain rescues. And that's where we'll end when we do the hike in September. Show them where we're going to start. So the goal, the, what we're going to do in September is start at Timberline. Oh, what, what we're doing at, in September. Yeah, we'll start at Timberline Lodge and then go all the way to Cloud Cap, which is about 27 miles, maybe closer to 28 miles. It says 26, but they're liars. Mm -hmm. They lie a little bit. You never know when they'll lie a little bit. Oh, mechanic, I forgot to say hello to you. I feel like a horrible host. I'm the hostess with the leastest. Uh, and it's just, just ain't right, oh, mechanic. Yeah, I he, do apologize. He knows we love him and would never do that on purpose. So, after we leave here at 
hopefully six o'clock in the morning, we'll be walking for the, through the nice cool Mountain Dew and we're going to stumble our way through all kinds of crevasses on our way to Elk Cove Camp. This may or may not be where we end up sleeping at the end of the day, but we're going to continue going past there. We hear that's like the best spot to camp. So that's part of why we want to do 10, 10, and 7 so that we can make it there when we do the hike in September. So we can make it there to camp on the last night. So this one, I mean, I, I'm, it would be cool to make it back there, but I feel like there are lots of other good spots to camp too. And that's, that would be a long haul for one day. Here, here's where we come to our after these two spots, there's another good camping spot. This is where we change and do something a little bit different on this backpacking trip if we're feeling it. We're going to take this loop, which comes into a, there's a little shelter. Somewhere. I've seen it before. I think it might be right there. Which would be cool to see. Gosh, we could even do the loop on the way there and then come back the PCT. That way, if we wanted to stay at the shelter, we could. Oh, wait, the shelter's farther up. I was off. The shelter's up here in the rocks. Right here. There it is. Cool. And that, uh, let's see. Uh, Goldie Cobb said he heard the shower gazing at Timberline was a total shit show. His brother went. That, and that was like Sunday night, right? Was Or Saturday night was the main night. But we're going to get, I'm so excited. We're It's it's still like full on and a, the moon isn't going to be lit much now too. And we're going to be out in the middle of freaking nowhere. I think it's just going to be so amazing up there. Yeah, I bet it was crazy. It's supposed to be one of the best years and all that stuff. Uh, yeah, I we wouldn't have we don't do stuff like that on a freaking Saturday night. Oh yeah, I bet it was like a party up there. We'd rather maybe have a few less uh, meteors and you know be alone in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Robert, we used to be allergic to exercise too. We definitely had a period. So when we were young and first got together, we hiked, we were in pretty good shape. We did a lot of stuff together. And then we had like a, I don't know, how many years? At least three or four year period where we were like, eh, let's, let's eat food and not do anything. And we got really into gaming. Game, yeah. It might've been five years. Might've been a decade. I don't even know, like it's foggy. It was, like, yeah, it gaming. was a long time. And we would go get, giant coffees at Dutch Brothers and call it gaming fuel, like the biggest, like 32 ounce, like, what do you call those things? Slushy coffees with so much crap. And then we'd just sit there and eat candy and drink coffee drinks and play video games. It was fun, like, I don't regret, it was a fun part of our lives for sure. And it also, yeah, it's like, it makes you appreciate getting back to the, back to the outdoors and stuff. It took extreme. Dill Hall said shower gazing sounds illegal. <laughs> it really does, Dill Hall. Jack, hello. Jack, thanks for coming Good in. Good to see, see you, you Jack. We are just checking out our... We, that's a good point. He doesn't gaze at his shower because he doesn't like getting hot water in his eyes. Yeah, I, I don't like, like getting any kind of water feel, in my eyes. I feel like I gotta wash my eyeballs out after I've seen myself. <laughs> Round really is a great shape. It's true. I mean, it's not a bad shape for a body. It's all about your priorities, what you want, what you care about, you know? So that's it. Then we come back home. All the way to Cloud Camp. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be awesome. We're gonna do that loop and then come back. We'll see, we'll see how far we make it. So how far is it total again? Here's how you start out, if you start out at Timberline. If we do that whole thing, it's 20 miles, right? With the loop? Is that what we decided? Uh, oh, sorry. Let's go back. Yeah, right about there. Because we start at 11. 
we are hardcore now, Goldie, but we have definitely gradually increased what we can do. We haven't, I, I feel like we haven't really stretched ourselves too far. 11 to get back to do the loop and get back on. Yeah, okay, so probably probably right about 20 then, or 21. Uh, 20. 20. 20, I'd say. We're probably going to do perfect. about half of and, and that's what we want. Like, that's this is exactly where we wanted to be when we were hit at this time of year because we're going to have to do that. It's going to be our first two-nighter when we go with Sally. I'll do a bet. I should do my bag breakdown. The good old days when life was easy. And I can answer your question, Goldie. You weren't in chat because you were on that... Extra strength hammock, looking hot. Should I go get a weight before I? You could, yeah. I mean, you're gonna repack it anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh yes, Robert, please. Please do. Anybody, any. Glory days. I've been putting together a list of. A playlist for my dad's uh, ceremony this Saturday and it's just so funny he loved oldies it's gonna be fun I put splish splash I was taking a bath on there and cuz all the stuff that when I would go through I could see him singing it in my head you know it's awesome Chris loves Amazon who is this Chris Chris Jackson well, we said that. I don't know if he would know about Chris Jackson loving Amazon. <laughs> Who's Chris? I will, Goldie. Absolutely. Yeah, I'm planning on bringing it every every time we go backpacking. I, the reason I got it, this little one, is so that I could take it backpacking. And it's like, if I don't, so often when I don't bring it on adventures or whatever, I'm, I'm just thinking, I wish I had it. So, yeah. You saw us hiking? Did we encounter Cocaine Bear? Ooh, not yet. I hear he got that good fish scale. <laughs> Pure, bur, palu, 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 How again. much did it weigh? We're at 32 pounds. And you still have to put your water. Two liters. Two liters of water and so, your coffee. So six pounds, so 38 pounds 38 total. Pounds. With everything. Not too bad. So we'll start out here. This is my water, my, the way I water myself. Oh, we're on boat. I water myself with these suckle bags. You do a little suckle, suckle. Suckle, he does. If you guys saw our mod, he just puts his mouth to it, sucks it right up, and it'll suck all the way up and compress. It's great. I'm so glad we got those bottles. They're awesome. I got groovy over the glasses, sunglasses, like old folks do. Yeah. Those ones are bomber glasses. Shout out bomber, not sponsored. I got a little cord just in case you need a little cord. So I keep this bag here with my water in case I want to put my phone in it or a snack or trash or you know, you never know what you want to do. Little suckle bags. Yeah, I got little suckle bags. So let's see what we got over here. Hanky check old mechanic, old mechanic out there. I got a good stash of hankies for the trail. One hanky, two hanky, three hankies for the trail. A compass. Uh, let's see, we'll check the other hip bag. The bag is a Gregory, and the model, I can't remember. A Zulu, 65 liter, Gregory. Other hit bag. Headlamp, oh, let me get out of there for you. There it's you okay. go. I don't mind. You want, you want your back front and center while you're showing it off. I got a front and center check here. Headlamp. 
you know? Yeah, Smuggler! You know he's been wanting this review. We got the black diamond headlamp. It's great. I don't know if it has a name. It's done great things. It's not too heavy. You could go lighter. You could go heavier. Is it Black Diamond? Oh, the type you mean? The brand. Black Diamond isn't the brand? Brand. I don't know the make. The make, yeah. I, or I know the make. I don't know the model. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Smuggles in the house. Whoop, whoop. No, I don't think he is, is he? Oh, I thought you said... Kathy oh. was saying shout out Smuggler. Shout out Smuggler. Because he's been waiting for this. Uh, oh. Do you have the bear mace? Did you answer that? I do have the you bear mace. We both do. Um, I also have a fourth hanky. I have one big lighter with a toker poker. The, there are multiple things for suckling, Robert. Multiple things. That's probably unnecessary to take the toker poker, actually. We're going to scratch that. We're going to go one big lighter. Just, uh, just bear spray, Rob. A, a gun is too heavy to be packing. Pure Waiting for hands it, but not here it feels bad, man. <laughs> Toothbrush. Well, ingenious uh, tube. Toothbrush. T-O-O-B. It's got your toothbrush and a little a refillable tube of toothpaste that you insert Rectal, I mean, in the rear. Uh, uh, and it goes like that. So when you take it apart, you just pull that off, and then you pull your your toothpaste out, and you do it up, and you put your toothpaste back, and then da, 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 da. boinkle bag. And hey, then boink, 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 boink. <laughs> hater bags are, or hater blockers are kind of like uh, safety cardboards. Ooh, we have those. Battery packs. You're yeah. gonna need them. Oh, we're getting there. Oh boy, we got a while. This is gonna be a late night. Probably unnecessary. Do you need one of those? No, I don't need safety from all of these wonderful people. This is going to be a, a upcoming review. We got the Rocky Talkie Walkie Talkies. Yeah. Um, they were kind enough to give us a little discount because we were like, "Hey, can we get a little discount?" And they were like, "Sure." So maybe ask for a discount. When for when Sad saw the bear and couldn't. And I was behind him quite a ways, and he couldn't warn me. We were like, it would probably be a good idea. Because when we're going up, I'm like, or sometimes, lately I've been filming more, and he's been going ahead when we're going up. But when we're going down, I'm slower. So it's like, we like to just let our, each other go at our own paces to a point. So it would be nice to be able to stay in communication all the time. Uh, we got the... Our very own... Wheat and Shaw originally made safety cardboard. You guys, this 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 uh, the real deal. backpack review and unpacking is brought to you by the Wheat and Shaw safety cardboard. Look, you can't even see JoJo if she doesn't want you to be seen. If You're I hate you invisible. enough, you won't if, be able to see me, so everybody here can see me. She's there. But if I hated, if any, if I disappeared to any of you, it tells you something. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't, don't, don't. Okay, Helinox, chair zero. The duck hunting gun. Pew, pew, pew. Don't sit in it hard, and don't be on uh, the upside of the weight uh, categories. Be under 250 and don't sit down hard. Don't sit in sand. But it's great. It's a good leisure item. You can just get to where you're at and just lay back, sit back in your chair and relax. All for just, I don't know, a little bit, maybe a pound. Not even a pound. I think I think they're 15 ounces. I want to say. So we keep that handy. Goldie wants to know if we followed a big list for all that shit to bring. Seems like you got it all. Lots of research, lots of like watching YouTube videos. Sad did more of it than I did. Like he got us together. We got a, we ended up getting an REI credit card so that we could get like your first purchase with the card. You get an extra percentage off and like you get like a hundred dollar bonus and all this stuff. So we ended up really, I mean, coming out of it really, uh, with amazing deals, and we did just get it all in one fell swoop. I mean, there are a few little additions, but 
all of Sad's time that he spent researching and watching stuff and just really, I mean, I feel like we got ideal gear with just and have only had to do slight tweaks. We love puzzles. We will def yeah, if we find obsidian, we'll for sure collect some. Oh, guys. We will look for obsidian. And we'll look for meteorites. Yeah. Um, I don't know that I've seen obsidian up there. These do wonders for hiking, if you're wondering. I was always an anti pole person. I was not sold on them. And really, I, but if now, I don't have an actual pack, like a heavy pack, then I feel like, meh. But with the pack, they're clutch. Uh, tent poles and stakes. He's our tent carrier man. A buff. Tent carrier man. A buff. Oh, I found that other buff. For when I get hot and sweaty and I want to be like, pretend like I'm on Survivor. You're voted out, bud. I'm so glad you did this unpacking so that I could. You're voted out. You've been voted off the island. The Osmo 3. You can see which buff you like. Oh, that's like Survivor. Yeah. I'm on, it, I'm on a team. There, I got them, I got that for free with my, I got these gardening sleeves for work so my elbow pits don't get all Ow, sticky. Ow, my head! Head. Oh, is it too tight? Yeah. It tried to eat my head. Maybe, maybe I'll bring it. Just a little stationary, you get hyperlapses. I wonder if we could stretch it out. It is oh. the road. It came with the road mic that we never really used. And then we actually have a. It actually came with the road mic that we lost somehow. We don't know where that's at. It might come back someday. Uh, let's see what else. We're getting to the good stuff, guys. I swear there's good stuff. There's no good stuff. Oh, here's the good stuff. Poop kit. Poop he brings kit. a whole roll of toilet paper. Ah, uh, that's yeah. like a half a roll. Of well, toilet paper. okay, so it's a half roll. You never the know. Cardboard part. You never know when you're gonna have. It's got hand sanitizer, my shovel, and my teepee, and some Sorry. some stinky deep deep. Yeah. yeah we there. just started using the deep deep. It Last was bad. trip, actually, because the trip before we were just ah, uh, I was miserable. All right, now to the main event. Food. That's all. That's our dinner and breakfast. Jojo made us uh, prepackaged and done up oatmeal and pad thai. It, the pad thai recipe is new, and we don't know exactly how it's going to turn out. So we have a backup Thai curry from. A but I did a lot of research on how to dehydrate and rehydrate food, and uh, I'm thinking it's going to be great. I'm really excited about it. I think it's going to be delicious. My top layer after food is layers. In case you need to get to your layers, it's nice to have them accessible. And oh, you don't even have those in your dry bag? My layers? No. Yeah. I want to be able to get to them if I need them. Oh. Tent. I have mine in my dry bag. Jojo carries our ground cloth and she keeps her layers in her dry bag, which I would have to undo all this to get to any of my layers. Yeah, I but feel like we always set up camp before we ever need layers. We yeah, typically, but I But it's probably I, a good idea. I'm a sweaty guy. So I need to I need to adjust. Sweat can kill you in the cold. Sweat's good for you in the hot. It keeps you cool. But once it gets cold, you need dry stuff and to not be sweating anymore. And I'm a sweaty guy, so I like to rotate my gear as I walk. Kangaroo Island TV. Ah, oh, hi Kangaroo Island TV. What do you do with a pack horse? You just welcome it in. <laughs> Certainly don't look it in the mouth either. This is my uh, Thermarest pillow. It's completely covered in 
Saliva? Uh, slobber. It is important in every relationship to have tent poles, it's true. It works itself out to a nice, like, feels good man size pillow. And doesn't weigh too much. And doesn't take up, eh, it takes up a lot of room, but it's not too good. And then in the dry bag, you guys, your battery power, the life, the lifeblood of the organization. Welcome, pack horses. We are the pack horses of the mountain. Unsung heroes. I wonder if I would like a buff. The Nemo. Uh, air mattress, tensor insulated air mattress. Love it. Uh, doo -doo -doo. One extra layer in case everything else got wet, something to put over, a little extra sleevage, and a towel. Probably don't need either of these things. But you never know. When you do, you do. Yep. That's it. So that is my bag. Oh, no, 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 sorry. I almost forgot some essentials. I think I'm going to bring this in case I want to get it wet. And like this would be a really good way to cool down. Right. Get wet at that. Or do we have crossings on that pipe? Yep. Yeah. Uh, right on the top, snacks. Emergency oh, I thought you said blanket. you didn't have snacks. I, I adjusted on the fly. Look at all the snacks. I, like, I have a lot of snacks too. We're snack, we're snack rich. Medical kit. And we're gonna bring cookies. I'm gonna get rid of some of my snacks. Water filtering implements. And that is it. That's real good. These are the instructions for the walkie talkies because they're new. And we don't I put mine in my hip pocket. I just folded it up and put it in there. A slingshot and fishing gear just in Ooh, case. Ooh, man, I want a slingshot. Who said that? He, Dill. Dill, I want a slingshot bag. He does. I just can't, I can't decide on what kind of slingshot, which leads me to the careful territory because it'll be like every week it's like, oh, it's only $45 for try a new slingshot. Slippery slope, these hobbies. Does Ari, I, I have slingshots? Probably not. I don't know. This is the Sea to Summit 35 liter origin recycled fabric lightweight waterproof <laughs> bag. Yeah, you can poke your eye out with that thing. I know. That's kind of the appeal, you know. It's true. You're like, oh yeah, I might be able to poke my eye out with that thing. So let's pack it all up while JoJo sings us a song. Maybe. Oh, a song? I don't know. Or maybe, what do you think? Do yeah, you feel like singing this song? song? What time is it? Yeah, the song seems perfect. Then we'll have doggy dinner time, then we'll cook dinner. We're going to cook dinner a little bit early because we got to go to bed early. we oh. got to be asleep by 9 o'clock. That's what we got to do. That's what we got to do. That's what we got to do. What should I play? I, I really, I kind of want to play my dad's song again. I feel like it's good for me to play it like over and over again because I'm going to be playing it at his... Uh, Celebration of life this Saturday. Yeah. So I'm gonna play it. Oh, I forgot. Sorry, uh, gold. I'm sorry to interrupt you. I don't care. I didn't quite uh, start yet. You didn't interrupt. Me. Goldie asked about my sleeping bag, and it's down here in this little sleeping bag compartment, and it is the Forte by Nemo, 35 degree Forte. <laughs> okay. That's oh, all I have. thanks, Kathy. Thanks, we. Oh. You too, Dapnik. Dapnik. See Dapnik party face, party face, party face. Don't forget to <laughs> to unpack your sure gel <laughs> things on your backpack. It repacks that small, yeah, Goldie. We've used it many, many, many times. Mine's bigger, but it's the same exact model, just for a woman. The ours will zip together. So if we're ever in a really cold night, we can just zip them right together. 
But yeah, mine won't fit in my bottom pack, and it doesn't fit sideways in my stuff sack. So I actually just ordered a new stuff sack today that's 14 inches wide instead of 12. Th these ones are 12 around, and the one I ordered is 14 inches by 12. So that's all I'm going to need to be able to get my sleeping bag in there sideways. I think it's going to be exactly what I need. Oh, I have the moist towel. Let's we. Just keep it moist. Yep, it's true.
Well, the summer is coming, and the trees are sweetly blooming, and the wild mountain time grows around the blue in heaven. Will you go? settings and a gifted memberships turn it on and then you could be in the emote club and see all the fun posts we do we don't we, we post occasionally I'm not gonna try to try to bait anybody in. thank you so much and, Kathy and we just we appreciate your support so much 
so Good damn luck. much. Sorry, what were you saying? Oh, so we, our Sawyer water filter, we only brought one. We had our squeeze filter and we did, so we had back flushed it and tested it month, like last year, but we were always packing in our water. We hadn't filtered water yet before our last trip. We filter water now. Now we filter water, but we didn't know, and it doesn't say anywhere either that you're supposed to, if it's been sitting for a while, or if it's new, you're supposed to black back flush it before you use it. And also, you should always bring your back flush syringe, and you should always have a little bit of fresh water in case you need to back flush it. So we were sitting there trying to squeeze it, and it wouldn't squeeze. We were about ready to have to hike out. We weren't going to be able to stay the night. And then I finally was like, I'm thirsty. Let me try to suck water out of that thing. So I suckled it. And it's and it like worked. It start, I mean it did not pour the way it's supposed to. It took us like 45 minutes to get the water that we needed for the rest of the night. But the Sawyer Suckle came through. So now we call it our Sawyer Suckle. We've got it all set up for But tomorrow. we tested it, we back flushed it, we have one each. So we are not, that's not gonna happen to us again. So that's Let's. we are definitely still in the learning process. We only started backpacking last year, our first trip. Did we only do one? So we did a fake one, and then we did a real one last year, and now we've only done a couple this year. So we're still new to backpacking, but we've really done, like, we don't, when we were young we would dive into things, but now we really just kind of uh, research a lot and think through a lot of stuff. I was going to see if I could, uh, let me see if I can find. We wants to know where he clocks on this. Oh, you're checking I, I, Well, I was going to try to find a live with someone that might be here. Maybe this will work. Man, Donald, that would be like so amazing. 45 minutes or something. Okay. I want to. So, what can I do? Okay. I'll do this. Wow, Robert. Yes. That's so cool. So. Someday. I hope we will someday, Donald. We, if I were going to do it for this channel, I would come down here. Oh wait, you can't see that. Uh, hold Get on. Get rid of us. Get no, rid of the us. No, I need us. We're pretending to be on this channel. Oh. <laughs> I just want to use this as an example here. So I would click on this dollar bill, dollar dollar bills, right? And you go to memberships. And then I would come up to these three dots. Oh, you can't see the three dots. Let me let me adjust it so you can see the three dots. And you have to do that. So you have to do that for each channel. Every channel. To be available. So these three dots right here. You see that? And then you click on that, and I gotta make it smaller again. Sorry, guys. Then you go to gift settings, and you click that. And a little pop-up window, <laughs> I gotta, dang it. This pop-up, allow gifts, turn it off on, and you're good. And we're out of here. Sorry, Man. Lickner, I didn't mean to, I'm not, I'm not trying restream, to Restream, restream alert! Not, I'm not trying to, breaking news, breaking news! Let's get right into the breaking news. That's so awesome. I miss so much YouTubing. I just can't wait until we're retired and we can YouTube and hike all the time. It doesn't show gift settings. Weird. Hmm. When you click on the little dollar bill, you go to member. You gotta go to membership, membership gifting. gifting, and then it's the three dots. Oh wait, no. Well, I think it's because I'm already a member here. Oh, because you're already a member. Let's see. Does it and it does it have to be in a live chat? I don't know. Oh, it has to be somebody that's got a membership thing. Membership thing. Oh, wrong button. This I shot it in. Huh. Weird. I'm sure, yeah, we can, let's see. That man, yeah, being able to do whatever you want, uh, 
whatever you want. That's a nice life. That's a nice life. That's a nice life. Sorry about the air conditioning noise in the background. We usually huh. kill it during the stream, but it's too hot today. And with all the ACs running, we're at, we're sitting at 80 degrees. Although it does, it's not really. My upper lip says it is really. It's not really. If like, but your upper lip would say that in 75. I think it's more like 75. Self-providing. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Should... Self-employed, self self-providing. I can't remember I took too many wheel spins to remember if I already took too many wheel spins. Uh, did, I, did I do two? Uh, did I do you three? You did a freebie and then, and then you, which was a joint and then a gravity bomb. So I need to do my 20. You owe a 20. You know what that means. Spin the wheel! Spin, Spin the wheel! wheel. Spin the wheel, spin the wheel. Hey, we actually stopped at the same time yeah, that time. Or anything but gummy joint. I'm not ah, except joint. I mean, it's better than gummy, but it'll get you real stung. You should just smoke. Do you have to smoke a whole joint when you sit when you pick joint? Why would I stop? Jojo's worried about me to my motivation tomorrow. She's thinking that all this uh, consumption of the, the kind is... <gasps> Kangaroo Violent TV! Thank you so much, Kangaroo Violent TV! Come on, when is it, is it gonna, does it pop up for that? It should, I'm pretty sure. Wait for it! I think so. I, I, it should. Come on, pop up. Wait for it! If, I, why wouldn't it? So, it's delayed. Oh, there it is. I like that. Mixing That's up. a good one. Mashing the potatoes. Thank you so much. Much, much appreciated. Yeah. I was going to say, if you don't make a cook, and then this kind of got me uh, sidetracked. So. Hotter, hotter than a hooker's doorknob on nickel night. Yeah. Whoa. Du Dutchman's like, uh, don't even talk to me about hot. I'd rather you not talk to me about it being hot. You don't know what hot is. Yeah. Eh? Robert's boss, stupid jerk. <laughs> Jeez. I mean, typically you guys are the hardest on, you know, you're the hardest on yourselves. You uh, self-employed bosses, boss bosses. The oh bosses. man, yeah. That's part of the reason I just like, I feel like it would be hard to do it because I'm overly motivated when it comes to working for somebody, but I like that I can just leave it behind, you know? We like the clocking out portion. We're hard all right, if you know what I mean. Who said that? Davig. Who said that, Davig? Davig said it. Davig. We haven't even had a single pay day tonight. What? Even with the feels okay, man? I don't think so. Maybe I just forgot it. Mm. I better pay pay a little bit. Jojo. Because it feels good. Because it feels good, man. Uh, thank you guys all for coming in and hanging out. Uh, sorry it's another PC stream. Or, I mean, the other ones have been Choose Your Own Adventure, so sorry for nothing. I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah, you could have had us anywhere you wanted in the whole world. Well, in the whole... We were ready to get into, go down to LAX and take international red-eye flights to Paris. <sighs> Not no. really. Only drive. We weren't going to fly. That's uh, so crazy, Dutchman. Yeah, Dillhole getting in on the Pepe party. Woo woo! It's a Pepe party in uh, here. We got a little, a little stony Pepe. Yeah, of course. A little Peepo. A little Peepo. Peepo. Oh, yeah, that's Peepo. Peepo Pepe. We're getting Peepoed. Peepo Pepe, Peepo we Pepe, get, Peepo Pepe. We're getting Peepo out. Peepo Pepe, Peepo Pepe, Peepo Pepe, Peepo Pepe. That's hard to say too many times. Peepo Pepe, everybody try it. Peepo Pepe, Peepo Pepe, Pepe Peepo. Peepo 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 Peepo. It's ridiculous. Yeah, Dutchman getting in on the Peepo Pepe party. Peepo Pepe. You guys ever heard of cashers? Introducing the casher. It goes on your bick. 
Oh, Kathy got the Pipo Pepe going. Made for cashing. I'm gonna bring this. You know what I mean? Yeah, don't forget it. I mean, remember it. Remember it. Remember, oh, I'm going I'm gonna put it in my bag right now. I'm gonna put it right in top. We always like to make two, two breakfast sandwiches each, and then we eat one on the way, and then we bring, and then we eat one for lunch. I was thinking it might be nice, like it might be nice to make like an actual real sandwich with like lunch meat and sprouts and stuff. Lunch meat. But that would get smushed. The good thing about the breakfast sandwiches is they're on like a toasted English muffin, so you can smush the shit out of them and they stay really nice. Cause of blah blah blah. Cause of blah blah blah. Blah. And because of BLT season, we're gonna have BLTs for dinner. It's BLT season, everybody. The big black bug bled on the, big, the bare brown floor. The big black bug bled on the bare brown floor. The big black bug bled on the bare brown floor. The big black bug bled on the bare brown floor. That's too hard. The big black bug bled on the bare brown floor. Big black bug bled on the bare brown floor. <laughs> That's hard. <laughs> PB and J jerky? That sounds delicious. Whether it's like. Oh, I thought it was. I thought that was a PB and jerky. Oh, PB, PB and J, J sandwich jerky. and jerky. Yeah, but the only thing, the only problem with that is the smush factor. Everything in the bag is pretty smush. You could go like the top pocket isn't bad. Like especially if you just kept that for just sandwiches. Did you say top pocket? We do have like jerk turkey sticks, like meat sticks. What's well, this top pocket? And granola <laughs> bars and almonds for snacks. And kale chips. Good question, Kathy. Let's try one. Here we go. Here we go. We're going in. We're going on deep, deep dive. No scam. Deep dive, no scam. They Kathy, say they have extra antioxidants. Thanks so much for coming in. Oh. Not sweeter. Whoa. That didn't look like a good taste. Very savory. No, it's delicious. You didn't even go, mmm. Mm, it is you delicious. Went, you went, mmm. It's because it's not sweeter. Yeah, it's like, do you want to try one? Tomato Legends in the house. Tomato Legends, we all, we're all about, we are all about tomatoes today. I wish I could show you, like, in the fridge, all of our tomatoes. Big up, Tomato Legend. I feel like, I'm not, I'm not sure. But I feel like maybe you might have been quoted tonight, Tomato Legend. There's more where this came from too. Do you have this camera on? Oh yeah. Look it. Your legend precedes you, Tomato Legend. Thank you for your bounty. Yes. I mean, Tomato Legend, it's hard to say. But thanks so much for coming in. That wasn't hard to say. That that came out all wrong. That was easy to say. Yeah, what's hard to say? Uh, I they're modded, but I don't recognize the name Tomato Legend, so I was wondering. What? Tomato? You recognize the name? Yeah, we've what? seen Tomato Legend. Why was I thinking? I'm sorry, Tomato Legend. I'm the worst. Tomato. And I got what? I got two watermelons. Oh my oh. golly. We're gonna make a watermelon huckleberry feta salad tonight. Mm, it's a good one. That's a recipe we just made up today. Oh my. Oh my and candy. basil, we're gonna put basil in it too, right? We're gonna make it tasty. So we're gonna make it tasty. Cause we have basil in our garden. So we're gonna just chop some up. Do you want a couple of these tomatoes? They really are delicious. Pant devils in the house. Hi, pant devil. Great to see you, pant devil. Heck yeah. I'm eating Shout some of these tomatoes. I'm eating these tomatoes. I just got done with this wheel spin. I would um, say they're more savory than like our red cherry tomatoes we have in our garden right now. Like quite a bit more. They don't have much sweetness to them. And I feel now that I don't eat processed sugar, I'm pretty sensitive to, sh to sweetness. Ooh. 
Whoa. What happened? Thermals and heating on in July. Yeah. yeah. I want. Uh, Donald, you're making a. Uh, you're making. I Scott. got you. Oh. Two. Okay. I'll eat them, but oh. they're more. They're the more ripe ones. Okay. Okay. Sprinkle a little salt okay. on. That's. You're right. We always do with. Any time we put tomato, was that tomato legend? Onto pant nibble, pant onto nibble. a dish or in a sandwich or whatever, you slice it up, you spread it out, you sprinkle salt and pepper on it. It is a must. Yeah, watermelon, watermelon. Oh my gosh, it's so good. It's a really good one too. I I have the touch for I have the the knocking capabilities. Heck yeah, Kathy. Mm. Are they purple purple veggies? Are supposed to be better for you. Mmm. There you go. There you go. Yeah, bud. Yeah. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. Those are delicious little suckers. Tomato legend first came in the Tapir's uh, boon boondocking. Oh, boondocking. What was the, that? The goondocking. Oh yeah. 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 That was a fun episode. Yeah. Now I remember. I remember. It was down on the pier. Remember? 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 You notice the, the, the wheel that I spin, it has an effect. And sometimes I don't remember so well. And then I remember. Yeah. It happens. It's all those. Oh, you know what time it is? <gasps> you know what time it is? Thank you, Mayhem RV. Dude. 27, that means you're only three more likes away from spinning the wheel again. Thank you so much, Mayhem. You know what time it is. If you don't, now you do. Until one comes out, 
And sometimes she'll put it in her mouth and then drop it on the floor and then pick it up off the floor and eat it. Good girl. There's no ants. Ah, uh, Dutch, it, it was close. I think it was close. It was real close to having to carry him. He did great though. I was like really impressed. It was not an easy hike. And he rocked it. Uh, those are member emojis, Tomato Legend. So if you join our Tapir Candle fan club, aka TCFC, uh, you can see our, our community member posts and use all of these fun emojis. And the more members we get, the more emojis we can make. And right now we have this many. And if you just want to watch and don't worry about that, go down to memberships and try to go up into the three dots and turn on gifted memberships. And then if somebody gifts memberships, you can take advantage of it. We've had no mayhem. We she already like she's good just carrying herself. Yeah. We don't. We would just end up having to carry her sooner if we made her pack her food. <laughs> I carry her food, but, and JoJo carries her water, pretty much. Yeah, and she a lot of a lot of hikes. There are plenty of streams for her to drink out of. Like our last hike, we only really had to give her water when we were camping. I wonder. Oh, maybe. No, because you No, not. I don't have premium. Nope, nope. No. A Sasquatch? Oh, that's a great idea. Let me write it down. I was going to ask, actually, if anyone had ideas for what our next emojis should be it, when they're unlocked. The Saddlebags is mm -hmm. a really good idea. She would look so cute, too. But all, another reason to not put them on her is she gets hot. She's black. And she is fairly heat sensitive. Her and Sad get hot pretty easy. I'm a sweaty, sweaty man. And Chloe is, I mean, she starts panting, you know, 80 right degrees. Right when I do. Yeah. <laughs> Me and her. She's a cute little panter. You guys are adorable together. They have the funniest little relationship. It's great. They headbutt each other, like roll around on the floor, wrestling and stuff. It's funny, she's actually eating her dinner now. She had food in there, I just added more in. But she knows, she knows this is her part of the show. She's like, I'm on. Yep, this is the time when she's got it. Uh, yup. Sad to peer is stoned Peepo. Pepe. It's Peepo? Uh, Peepo. Peepo. I better uh, start, like, dinner soon. We're partying. Like, I can do dinner, honey. I'm happy to do dinner. You don't want to do dinner. I don't mind. You just got to make the aioli. Okay. He makes the best BLTs. I don't. Gotta go! Dill take Thank it easy! Thank you for hanging out. We love ya! Uh, we are... We're going to try something new on our BLT. We're going to try a new technique. Right? We're going to do the two kinds of bacon? Yeah, double bacon. I, yeah. I would want mine rather than having any stacked, just like... Alternating? The alternating, yeah. I want mine to overhang a little bit. A yeah, little overlap. I know, you do. I know you do. I want a little overlap. So we have like a peppered, thicker bacon, and then we have a just smoked, thinner sliced bacon. Okay, Chloe, we'll catch up. We'll catch back up with you. Okay, so it's okay. Bye. Oh, burp, she burped. Burp. <laughs> we caught her burp. I'm glad we caught her burp before we left. Should we start this? Yeah. Start these shenanigans? Let's start these shenanigans. You ready to do yeah, shenanigans, everybody? We gotta bake some cookies to take with us, too. I can't believe you offered to cook. You're the best. I love you so much. You're so welcome. What, what, what the hookup I just received? Haha, <laughs> yeah. You know I'll hook you up, baby. Oh, we can. You know I'll hook you up. Hope you're doing well. Let's do one of these in celebration. Once we get to 30 likes, Sad has to spin the wheel again. He's already too stoned to make dinner, so... So we might as well do one of these 
in anticipation of three more lights. So smash it up. What are you doing? You're doing a what? Oh, yeah, I see some shrimp. Just a little tasty taste. I see a little tasty taste. Just a little tasty taste. A little tasty taste. I don't know who's doing what. Who's doing what? Who's doing I've what? been making those three ingredient cookies. Or, <laughs> I made them four ingredient cookies because I put cinnamon, honey, oatmeal, and applesauce. I've been making those to go with my breakfasts. That sounds delicious. I love them. I'm so glad Sab discovered them. Will you remind everybody exactly how that recipe goes? It's one cup of oats and half a cup of applesauce. That's all you need, but I like doing, um, I like doing cinnamon and vanilla in there as well. And you bake Optional. It? And yeah, you bake them at 350 for 15, min for 15 minutes, I think. Yeah, 15. And they're perfect. I mean, they're just wonderful. I have, I usually have an apple and almond butter for breakfast. So adding in the extra like fiber and uh, it's like a delicious treat in the morning. So we like to put our bacon into a cold pan and we like to cook our bacon over a fairly low temp. That allows it to render out the fat and crisp up real nice without burning uh, and sizzling everywhere. I saw, I saw a short and this old lady's like, or somebody, I don't even remember what it was. Shout out YouTube. But they were like, if you're popping grease everywhere, you're not doing it right. And that made me think, maybe we're cooking our bacon too hot. And we were. Like you can it's really, more delicious at a lower temperature. So much more delicious at a nice low. In, in our opinion. In our opinion, yeah, of course. Mm. I was going to ask Jojo, do you know, do we still have the thing for the coffee to go into? The glass thing, or we just use a jar? Oh yeah, we still have the glass thing. Is it up? Yeah, Where up top, here? yeah. That's a lot of bacon. That's a whole, but we're gonna use, we'll have some for tomorrow. Yeah. Is that the plan? I mean. Maybe. Yeah. No, we're definitely not gonna use all that. Oh, oh, that sounded like a challenge. Uh, I mean, Sad might have two BLTs, you never know. I he used, is. I used to do, I would have he two, has the, I would have, I would have two BLTs and tater tots and coleslaw. He has All been spinning the wheel too. I, I, we used to, yeah, we used to overeat like crazy, man. I, it's so nice to not. <laughs> like overloading the body. Oh look, we have a uh, that strawberry. We haven't eaten that strawberry yet from our garden. It we so we didn't. We could put that in the feta salad. We didn't realize. I'll go get some basil. That when. You first plant tomatoes, you typically don't get very many strawberry, strawberries for a while. They just put out runners. And we're like just now starting to get good strawberries. I had to get my uh, carafe shed gang. It was up in the, it was up above the, the dump. Oh, do the dump of the coffee? Yeah. Yeah, I like, why not? Everybody wants to see a little dump. Yeah, you guys want to see sad dump? 
You guys uh, not see me dump? Dump is cold brew, that is. Cold brew is amazing. I if tell them about it. You, instead of using hot water to brew the coffee, you just have to sit it in cold water for 12 to 24 hours, and it makes, I mean, I guess you have to use the proper amount, but it makes a, a coffee concentrate, like a shot of coffee, okay. and it's way, yep, it's way less acidic. Um, and you get all those bold, rich flavors of the coffee, but not all the acid. So people, uh, the reason we got into it was from having just like stomach issues with coffee. From drinking soda from dusk till dawn. Yeah. And eating garbage. And blaming foods. it on the coffee. But we're really glad we did it. It's great for taking on trips and stuff because you can heat it up because it's a concentrate. So you can add hot water to it or you can have it over ice. But uh, Sab drinks a lot of coffee, so he has to, he brings a bottle oh, of straight no. up concentrate. What? It's not a good dump. That's okay. Well, it's a it'll weak go. stream. Sometimes they do that, yeah. Sometimes they're weak stream. I was hoping for a good dramatic, dramatic apple. I got a clogged up little. Okay. We'll check back with you later. Sometimes that happens. And I think it is the expert, like, the better you pour it, the slower you pour it, the more time and patience you take to pour it, the better it'll drain. I made cherry jam. And it has no, it's literally just cherries. And look how jammy it is. Or I should take it over to this camera. Look how it's like. Like what are you doing? What are you doing? Jammy. Very jammy. I just, mm, I just cooked it for like three hours. She just sat in the kitchen on a stool and stirred it for three <laughs> hours. <laughs> Pretty much. I had my phone in one hand, like picking out songs for my dad's uh, playlist while I was stirring with the other hand. I'm actually kind of surprised my shoulder doesn't feel it. <laughs> oh, I am. I got, I got, I got, a, the folks want to know. Are you leaving the fence and just finishing it with a natural finish? Or are you painting it white again? Uh, OM says, oh my goalie says, very jammy. Looks good, JoJo. Weepsaw says, you know what I pretend my jar of Nutella is. <laughs> <laughs> Not, he said Nutella. Now with 33% more frag. Are these dishes clean? Oh, I didn't get done putting them away, maybe. I almost got them done. You almost tricked me. I put the bacon scissors in there. Oh, no, the bacon tricked me this morning. Tricky us this morning. I think I'm going to leave that bowl. I'm sorry. That's closest to it. I hit the wheel too many times. I'm yeah, sorry. you did. It's not my fault. It's a prank. It's, it's Frank's fault. Well, now Frank's here, we can blame him. <laughs> Gotta have a Frank goat. A Frank goat? Sca scapegoat. Frank, Frank goat. goat. Who are you calling a Frank goat? Who are you calling a Frank goat? Great to see you, Frank. Uh, we're gonna do this hike tomorrow, or part of it, and it's we're gonna camp on the mountain, and it's gonna be and it's like amazing. Meteor shower central. Well, Sunday I think Saturday night was like the ma the maximum amount of viewage. Blaming the wheel spins again. Whoa, Goldie. Uh, oh, don't hold me accountable, Goldie. I totally bailed on it. I didn't want to make he noise while she was playing music. It's her he, fault. He was touching 
Your face. Okay, so look at these. We're gonna process these on Wednesday. They're still a little bit Wait hard, so they need to they need to ripen right. up. But I'm gonna make jam out of these on Wednesday when we get home. Or maybe Thursday, I don't know. I might be too tired on Wednesday. Do we see them? Beautiful peaches! peaches. Billions of peaches! Glenn C, you missed doggy dinner time. Oh no! Glenn C, you just missed it. Millions of peaches, peaches from Hilda's. Millions of peaches, peaches on trees. Yeah. Farmer Shady with the green hearts. Oh, oh boy, I'm tomato. sorry. Mad busy looking for parts after the premiere chat and totally forgot. Sad to peer dedication, man. Mods and mods, you know, you know how it goes. I know how it goes. You gotta watch those premiere chats, they get litty. <laughs> you get somebody in there going all, all, all litty. Get litty. Go, Jeff. Maybe this tomato is best for the today. Where'd you go, Jeff? I'm getting the tomato and the lettuce. And the feta, and the huckleberry. You need hands? You want me to come no. in? I'm a lettuce head. Subscribe. Shout out! I'm a lettuce head. Heck yeah! I'm a lettuce. I'm a lettuce head. I recognize that name. It happened last week, but I thought since you had a oh. lettuce head in your hand, it would be a good time to shout them out. Yeah. Shout them out. Six uh, one five. But, uh, you said you were going to get basil, but you still haven't done that. <laughs> you got to get basil. I need scissors. Here I got here. huckleberries. I got feta. I got watermelon. We have five of these bad boys. Full of watermelons. Chloe loves watermelon. She was doing like Remy used to do, just sitting right outside the kitchen begging for watermelon. It was too cute. She doesn't like a whole lot of veggies, but most fruits she really likes. We barricaded ourselves in today. I'm gonna wear an apron. I'm gonna wear the apron Miss Southern Belle sent me. Look, it even has, it even has Miss Southern Belle sticker on it. We love Miss Southern Belle. I don't want to get any bacon grease pops on my apron. I don't even have a chat in here. It's Sad's job to read it to me, so we're just gonna have to wait till he gets back. He'll be back soon, I hope. Oh yeah, look at him. He's gonna need more basil than what he got. You're gonna need more. You're gonna need more basil than what you got. two. Okay, I need a real bowl for this salad. Tips. That's what you gotta do. Oh, why am I rinsing it? There's even no need to. 
Oh. We don't mind a few bugs. Yeah, we don't mind some bugs. Shout out Kangaroo Island TV. Yeah. Yeah, keep your basil we dry. We need a bacon press still. Oh, mechanic. Why haven't we gotten a bacon press yet? It's absolutely ridiculous. It's I'm, absurd. I'm disappointed in us. It's absurd, we tell you. You're on, double, you're on double cam. Tell them all about how... how what mad. the frick is wrong with us? Not getting a bacon press still. Old Mechanic's been like, bacon presses are the best. We know Old Mechanic knows what's the best, and yet we continue to not ever get a bacon press. It's asinine. Totally freaking asinine. I I really am missing I'm missing you guys. I just haven't even heard a single thing you've said since I've been in here. Uh you've been busy. You've been busy. It's not your fault. I just missed them. I heard 615 came in and that's really exciting. I'm like really excited about that. Makes me want to play Tennessee whiskey. Maybe a little after dinner Tennessee whiskey uh, serenade for my buddy, 615. My bad, I'm the worst co host. Huh? So you, when you gotta pee, you gotta pee. When you gotta get basil, you got to get basil. That's it. Okay, let's catch up. Does anyone know where all this bacon is going? So Glenn, see a portion of it is going on BLTs this evening, and then a portion of it is pre-cooked for breakfast sandwiches tomorrow. Because um, we like to be able to get out of here quickly. But look how small it is once you once it's all cooked down. There's a teeny little pieces of bacon. There's a teeny little piece. Oh, you know what time it is? Oh, time to spin the wheel. Spin the wheel! Spin the wheel! Oh, wrong camera, sorry. No gummies! No gummy, big bake, no gummies! Boom! Does anyone know where all of this bacon is going? Let me put that down! I'll put, put that, that down. down! I'll put that down! Frank's right. here, right? We didn't just go into the Frank zone without him. Oh, yeah, Frank is here. Okay, we, good. We, I'm we glad can, you're here, Frank. You can only venture into the Frank zone with Frank here. Is that true? Well, I don't think that's true. I wouldn't dare venture into the Frank zone without Frank as a guy. Oh, uh, yeah. And let me know whether or not. I can find that now. I won't be pitting that now. I won't pit that dog right now. Put that frickin' dog. No. The dog's on a beanbag. It's a beanbag dog. Did you pet that dog? Yes. We do still eat quite a fair amount of bacon, but we do not save the bacon fat and put it in everything anymore. We cut, we draw the line at that. I'll bet that bell. I don't know where it come from, but I love Frank doing it, so. He showed us where it came from the other night. Oh, was I, did I miss it? I must have missed it. Where were you? Where were I? So, Goldie, here's the, here's the setup I do backpacking. I got the Duplo from Pulsar, and I do double cart in this because it's super light and it keeps the carts somewhat insulated and protected from dust and debris and heat, and it's lighter than my other battery that I typically use. And then also it's a USB-C, so it charges a little bit quicker with our portable battery packs if we got stuck out there. Total overkill, but that's what I usually rock. Or what I've been rocking as of recently. Don't buy budget carts, Gildy. 
Just don't do it. It's not worth it. It's like a waste of money. Period. That's half price. That's that's what you get for half price. Those are by, both live resins. Guess which one's better? Yes, I say game. You'll never guess. Okay, we gotta do it. I gotta hear it. We put balsamic, a little balsamic on this too, right? Ooh, a little, little yeah, a little aged. Little, I'm gonna wait to little, put the huckleberries in until the very end. I'm gonna mix it, then put the huckleberries on the top. Third time he really leans into it with his whole face. <laughs> he really leans into it with his whole face. Dinner high. Front bow camp. We're doing uh, the the BLT season. We only do BLTs once in a while, and Our, it is right at this time of season. We do them um, like regularly this time of year. Once heirloom tomatoes come out, we have BLTs once a week until heirloom tomatoes go away. So go away. We're gonna be having BLTs once a week until the first frost. Basically, we have a bunch of heirloom tomatoes in our fridge. This is the heirloom tomato we're going to be using this evening. Very exciting, very exciting stuff. And the bonge. The bonge will be loaded with some bluebells. It is a blue, wait, it's uh, Blueberry syrup. Blueberry syrup and Southern, Southern, and Southern Bell. Southern Bell, you got it. Southern Bell is a Irene cross. It's an old OG strain. And it's delicious. It's delicious. Oh, I don't, you, you still got to make the aioli too. Oh, uh, you know, I don't, I, you know, I, you know, I don't do anything. You know, I just like put some stuff in it. Okay, I was gonna, I, actually that reminds me, that's perfect segue into cooking tip by Sad. You ever want to make an amazing sauce? 
start with mayonnaise and add whatever flavor you want to it and it's going to be amazing. Maybe if you want it a little zingier, you put a little white vinegar in there. If you want a little mustard kick or sweetness, you know, you just do that. But you can make, everybody can make like such amazing sauces so easily. In the Should world, I do garlic? I always or, do, when I, I mean, we the do ones have that pesto. you love, that you, I do salt, pepper, and roasted garlic. Okay. But I was thinking we should put pesto in it, because we have pesto. But whatever you want. We do, but I'm like, I kind of want this first one to be a little more classic. Then I would just do salt, pepper, and roasted garlic. And I can make it. I will definitely make it. Don't even worry about it. I'll be okay. able to make it right after I fulfill my weed agreement. Okay, deal. Thank you so much, Trish. Much appreciated. Do you want do you want it your bread toasted? I mean it came from the freezer so I can just put it on warm or I can toast it a little bit. What do you want? Uh, whatever you're doing. I'll take a light yeah, toast. Yeah, I think a too. light toast will be good since it came from the freezer. Fire in the hole. Fire in the bowl. Light it up. Weeks mom wants her bread toasted, please. Okay, you got it. You got it, Weeks mom. Weeks mom's a great host, if you know what I mean. Yeah, yep. I can't see it. Oh, I gotta make aioli. Here I come. Oh, heck yeah, Trisha. Trisha's making homemade fries. Ooh, yeah. I, I was thinking about doing fries with these, but... Okay, so I guess the question is, do you do air fryer, real fryer? And if you do real fryer, do you do the double fry technique where you fry them and then fry them again? I feel like those are some of the best, the best executed fries that I've ever done were the ones where I took the time to, you do the low fry oh. at like 300 and then you turn it up to like 350 after you take them out, you turn it up and then you put them back in for a couple minutes. Did you bring a chip? Oh, you did. Good job. We might need more man eggs. I don't know. We might need more man eggs. That's like to me. We might need more man eggs. Where is all the bacon going? You want a salt and peppy tomato end? Our for our first heirloom tomato, you know we can we can bonk them. No, no chat right here. Yeah. We can let's bonk them. What do you call? Bonk. Ding. Boom. Mm. Oh, it's mm. good. It's so good. Oh, they're going to be perfect BLT tomatoes. It's so good. Yes, we need man spread. We need man egg. Yeah, thanks, Frank. We're making this bacon tasty. Extra man eggs, Frank. Frank, uh, have you been keeping up with Billy Blue? Has anybody been keeping up with Billy Blue? I just pop, popped in today and he's definitely exploring the outer reaches of places. Uh, definitely worth checking out his channel. Can I get the mayonnaise? I might have used the last of it. Oh, no. Nope. Might need a spatula. I might need a spiritual. Do you think that means something? What? Oh, just oil separation. Just yeah. stir it. You need a spatula? No, I need a spatula. Very good. You know I do. You know I do. You always want to make a little extra sauce because you're going to use it. It's true, Kathy. Since we got our air fryer, we love making homemade fries. It's so easy and delicious. 
We always, like, we've been tempted to get a deep fryer a few times in our lives, and I'm just so glad we never did, because you would just deep fry stuff. Uh, this is the Primal Kitchen. Can I put that bike in? <laughs> yeah, you know you want to. Can I put that bike Avocado mayo. Made with real avocado oil. Oh, that salad's gonna be freaking bomb bomb. A bomb bomb. Uh, uh, uh. Makes me wanna hump the air. It's so delicious looking. Wait, maybe maybe we should open a new one of these, you think? Yeah, smell of vision 2000 is working great. All Baltimore brand smells is temps and bacon. That smells good. It's good, yeah. yeah. It's totally good. You're just high. You just had too many, too, too many, many wheel spins. This makes me think of my, every time I use romaine for a sandwich, it makes me think of my dad because he always liked to pretend he wasn't picky, but he really was so picky. He's like, oh, I really like romaine lettuce on my sandwiches, as long as it doesn't have too many of the, the like, ribby things, like the bottom parts of the lettuce. <laughs> like, you like what you like? Yeah, you're picky. Yeah, but you don't say I'm not picky and then say something like that's that. That's true. You think that's enough? Yes, I All think right. that's a perfect amount. I think I'm going to use every little bit of it. I like a lot of lettuce on my BLTs. Sad yeah, likes one layer. I yeah, like a whole lot. Some salt. We buy this granulated roasted garlic at our local uh, bulk section at our grocery store. And it's oh, almost bad. Oh, almost bad? No way. I almost dumped it. Oh, on the, on the floor? Yeah. And it is awesome. Not bad. Not bad, man. It's super good, man. Oh, this is going to be amazing. Can I lay this on the lettuce? Yeah, totally. It's just going to go on there anyway. Oh, my goodness. Have we told the folks what's going on? Totally in there. Uh, we have in here watermelon, feta, fresh basil from our garden, huckleberries that we picked last week, and um, a little bit of aged balsamic vinegar. <laughs> then, then strawberry. Did you put the strawberry in there? Oh, this is our strawberry from our garden. Did you want to put it in there? We could top a little, we could do a little toppy strawberry. Why the heck not? Why the heck not? Why the heck not? Thanks for hanging out, everybody. We are just doing a shorty tonight. We're it's probably going to hop off here after a, do you want to do a taste test? Or do you want to do a full... A full eating. Uh, How are you feeling? It's both our first heirloom tomatoes and our first watermelon of the season. Um, I think air sex champions, by the way. Oh, well, that's quite the compliment. Air sex champions? Yeah. Yeah. We like to rub our butts together uh, quite often. <laughs> No, we do. I Not guess usually how we get. We in well, we rub we rub many things together in the air. Stop. That'll make a I turd. Gotta, I gotta get out of here. Nothing must end, Frank said. Nothing I mean, we can farm. Okay. But guess who's here? Farmers here. We got more time. We ain't gotta go nowhere. Yeah, we might as well stay through. I wanted to do. Love bang. I wanted to do well, whether he's here or not. Uh, Tennessee whiskey in honor of. Six one five. I wanted to do mukbang in honor of all all the boys. Yeah, mukbang, baby. We don't just well. We have you used to that. That was your style. You didn't ever want to be on camera. I'm not I'm never really. A I don't ever mind it. Proponent of eating on camera, but at home, yeah, and you know, like give a little taste test after you cook. But You've just gotten more it. used to it. I feel like. I love it. It's my favorite. Yeah. I'm going to be eating, eating here. 
I'm gonna change my name to Eating Tapir. Yeah. And then we're gonna order Tapir meat and try. Tapir? No, we're not gonna do that. Oh. Shed Gang says wait, wait. Wait. Glen C says wait. I feel like it's so thin. Why is it so thin? I feel like it's broke. I, like it's I think that that oil separation, yeah, did make it thin. It's broke. Should we just get a new one? <sighs> I think. Or maybe the heat. I don't know. I'm sure it's the oil. Like there was like extra oil. Somebody's trying to get in. Just kidding. What yeah, was that? Mean. Did you fart? A little bit. It Is that what that? It sounded like click. Sparky fart. Clicking. Yeah, sparky fart. Okay. Well, if you want to get. What do you think? Yeah, I mean it's pretty. It looks loopy. Let's try. And uh, hurry! All Everything's right. fresh and ready to go. Why did I give him a job? <laughs> I should not have given him a job. Oh, come on. That can't be blamed. Your, uh, your only job was making the aioli, and now it's holding us up. Give me some salt and pepper. Give me some of roasted garlic. Oh, yeah. my gosh. Give me a stat roasted get. Boot this is bat. not going to Boot bat. It's going to be so much better. Here, we can just reuse this one. Okay, well, I mean, we could use that for some. Like, go ahead. No, it's gross. We don't Just use this. Just use a new one. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm coming. I'm Get going. A spoon. Oh my god. Why are you Hurry. hoarding all my stuff? Put this in there. You told me to get it. I'm sorry. Okay, here, put them in there. Okay. Step. I can't believe you're gonna try to use that goopy stuff. I you. <laughs> it wasn't bad, but it was not. I. It I, was goopy. It I'm was just so kidding. goopy. I'm just messing with you. I'm just messing with you. Okay. Mix it up with that. Let's go. Hurry it up. <laughs> Hurry the frick up. Oh, yeah. That's what you want. Okay, we're good. Go. Okay, go. Hand. Hand. I want a knife. Hand. I'll give you... A hand. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Good thing we only lightly toasted the bread. Oh, Lord, what have we done? Holy man, that was a close call. Whew, we made it just in time. Now it's still fresh. I'm so oh, excited. No. You reported us or old mechanic for not wearing shoes? Report OM for not wearing shoes. I'm not going to say that. I'm what not. What, uh, never mind. Ha! Bod, we up. have double not wearing shoes going on nope. right now. Oh, I lost my chat. It went dark. Frank, Frank that's the new thing. You got to do everything like barefoot and buck naked. That's the new rule? So it's baby steps. Mmm. -hmm. Gray 1107, thanks for coming in. Hey, Gray. We're getting ready to eat food on the internet. Yeah, we, we just are. Made a, Jojo just made us a delicious meal. Fresh heirloom tomatoes, romaine lettuce seasoned, bacon of two thicknesses. We're going to try a dual Two types thick and thicknesses. Two types and thicknesses. We're going to try a dual bacon on the BLT and see if there's a preference or if we like the mix of the two. Do you want lettuce on both the top and bottom or you just want top lettuce? Uh, top lettuce. And she also made us this amazing watermelon, basil, feta, strawberry, huckleberry salad, which is so good. Thanks for coming in, Gray. Gray uh, produces some great content and shorts out on the Columbia River Gorge. I highly suggest subbing to his channel. Man, that salad's banging. Has a little balsamic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm overlapping Sad's bacon a little bit here. You didn't miss Quiplash. We we could probably squeeze. You think we could yeah, squeeze Yeah, we could in, squeeze that game in. Squeeze in a, uh, a round of Quiplash before we go. 
I think so. Uh, right after dinner, farmer, if you're around, quiplash. And mm. bye bye most of the bacon. Ha ha ha. Cop at that sandwich. Lindsay says. Cop, cop at that bacon sandwich. Cop at that bacon sandwich. Mmm. -hmm. Guys. Oh, oops. Dang it. Ladies, I just, gentlemen, Pac-Man. Pac I did it backwards. That's okay. You just, oh. You can, I'll have double lettuce. That's fine. I'm down with whatever. I like all, all types of situations. It looks like a Pac-Man about to eat a pellet. Uh, yeah. It's like a little pack tomato. Wow, I like the flip. That was a good technique. Thanks. I'm gonna eat your watermelon salad while you're gone. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. I got more in here, so. You brought those in already, huh? Oh, it's so good. Did you get forks? Uh, no. <laughs> they were supposed to go on the plate with a oh. fork. Oh, okay. <laughs> But it's okay, we can just put them on when I bring them in there. Oh, that no, we gotta put them on in there. I love you. Yeah. Duh. Which one's me? Uh, that one. Look at the cute little strawberry on top. Little strawberry slices. Yeah, we have a couple extra tomato slices. Should we, should we doink? What doink? Doink. Mmm. -hmm. That's a good freaking tomato. Mm. That's a legendary tomato. Plump and juicy. Mm. Happy tomato season, everyone. <laughs> Frank, you might have missed it. Have you ever seen this? <coughs> Did you see that episode, Frank? You might have missed that episode. When Sad, Sad was in peril. Are you okay? I have pepper in my throat. Ah. Uh, Donald, good night. Oh, there it goes. Sleep tight. Rest well. Thank you so much. Oh, fried egg. Shaggy wants a fried egg. Mmm. Oh, we're eating with your picture. I was asking Frank if he saw that episode. Can I put that around? Yeah. Shed Gang says, no, man, no tomatoes. Thank you. Oh, oh, that watermelon salad tastes like candy deliciousness. <laughs> so good. <laughs> it's like sweet, sweet candy. Her face. Oh, oh. The addition of the huckleberries, holy crap. Oh, you don't like tomatoes, Shed Gang? But it would be delicious with a fried egg. We decided to keep it rather traditional tonight. I guess I'm putting that off there. So I can have like a whole... Mm. 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 Oh, so good. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> you need that? <laughs> Not to wipe my mouth. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Yum, yum, yum. I used to get heartburn from tomatoes, but then I quit overeating and I stopped getting heartburn. It's amazing. Teeth are so nice. They really are. My dad only had, when I was a little, he only had 14 teeth. And he was always like, your teeth are so important, but then we never brushed our teeth as kids. <laughs> like, take care of your teeth, but go to bed now. That's hard. 
Kids are stubborn. Kids are stubborn and lazy. I smell mm. sexy candy. Mm. Yeah. I was singing. Who's that loud? The other morning I was singing, I smell sex and coffee. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm like, oh, I, see how, I see how he came up with that song. Mm. 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 <gasps> it's the best thing I have ever eaten. Oh. And the back and forth. I'm so glad we didn't do pesto mayo. Because I feel like the basil really stands out in this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> bacon, bacon. I missed bacon the most when I wasn't eating. When I stopped eating red meat and pork. I miss bacon the most, for sure. I've known vegetarians who are vegetarian except that they eat bacon. I could be a bacon vegetarian. I used to always say I couldn't do it, but I feel like, I mean, I could. There might be a point where we decide to go more veggie. Bacon adds that crispy umami thing that everything kind of needs. Salty, smoky. Oh. So, so it would it goes with everything vegetarian Oink. perfectly. Oink, Oink. Oink. I always like to, I actually did that when we went out to dinner with Wheat and Shaw 2 is... Wheat and Shaw 2? <laughs> I didn't know there was a sequel. <laughs> we always, or I always get the veggie option, add bacon. Pork rinds, Trisha, that's so funny. It's the one thing we don't like. Like, we like to eat everything. It's the one Pretty thing. Pretty much. Something about the coating. The grease in your mouth. Like, the greasy mouth coating. Mmm. Mmm. She's had mouth coating. That's the best. This is the best. Happy tomato season. Yeah, yeah. And then after we eat, we'll do a quick game of Quiplash and call it a night, right? Sounds good to me. We gotta get on the road at four in the morning tomorrow. What? I haven't tried pork rinds in a long time. I don't know, I might like them now. Sad used to not like squash and I didn't have pork rinds until I was older, and I just instantly was just like, no, and I've, all, I, I've never really given them a fair chance, and I'm almost scared to give them a fair chance. Because yeah, at this point in our lives, it's like... The slippery slope. Yeah. But man, I can't imagine not liking them, really. You know, they got all that good stuff. <laughs> Spring. Zero. I'm still going to give it a one. No, I mean, no, okay. oh. in the realm of anything's possible. But we want to make our first uh, sleep stream when we get a thousand subs. Well, I don't know. Sad's talking about maybe staying up all night, but I'll be sleeping. I'm going to be up doing nothing illegal. I love that watermelon salad. I love this BLT. This is the best. I'm gonna go night crawling without doing it. We're gonna go out on the town. You could just leave the camera. Ring on. the bells. You have two different streams. You can leave the camera on me and then start it out on the out and about stream. And that way you can check on me while I'm sleeping. Yeah. The struggle is real. I think we only need 333 more subscribers, Trisha. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. We... Yeah, I, I have snored before when we backpacked, right? I snored. Because I was so tired. 
And uh, did I not wear my strap? Or oh, my strap came loose a little bit. For strap. For sleeping strap. Mm hmm. I feel like I got all the huckleberries. No. Why'd you do that? I got a lot too. Sorry. You always do that. I'm sorry. Don't be sacrificing. I'm sorry. Mmm. Mm. Sad needs PJs with footies for the 24 hour stream. Yes. It's a really great idea. I talk in my sleep, so. Sleep stream might be interesting. Around here. Look at all, I still have a bunch of huckleberries and I ate like a bite with a ton of them. Glendar! Glenda! Hi Glenda! We're having really delicious watermelon huckleberry. Why did you do that? Instead of basil. Because you did it, you started it, and I just gave you back what you gave me. Maybe not even that much. It's so it. delicious. And our first BLTs of the season, we we're just saying we only eat BLTs during heirloom tomato season, and we have one a week until the heirloom tomatoes are gone. Northern Trail Dog's here too. Hi, Northern Trail Dog. Once we're done eating and cleaning up, we're going to do a game of Quick Flash. And then we're going to call it a night because we're going to get up at 4 in the morning tomorrow and go hiking. Go backpacking, actually. We did a review of my backpack. It's weighing in at 38 pounds, 4 ounces, and 6 grams. No. I made that part up. I made that part up. Thanks for coming in, Trail Dog. Great do to we see have, you. Do we have time for sad Ooh. comedy? Excuse me. I am. Yeah, I'll play a song. Yeah, I'll play a song while we're loading up Quick Flash. Excuse me. How rude. What do you call a sad without a comedy routine? What? I don't know. I was hoping you could help me come up with a joke. I know. I couldn't come up with anything. <laughs> I don't know. I was hoping you could come up with a joke. They call me crusty. They call me super crusty. Uh, they call me crusty. Oh, watermelon, basil, feta, huckleberry, strawberry, balsamic, really? salad. Really? Yeah, the Boy. huckleberries and a little bit of strawberry. Like, it would have been nice to have a little more strawberry in there. But the balsamic, I think, really kicked it up a notch. Oh, so good. So, so good. Hey, hi, Tess. Hi, Tess. Is he right? Hi, Tess said, I feel hungry when I see somebody eating. And it's true. Like, I will have just eaten. And I watch somebody eat and I feel like I want to eat again. Like, I'm not hungry, but I feel like I want to eat again. But I, I love it. I love watching people eat I and make food. It's crazy how, yeah, it makes me hungry too. Just, just the sight of it makes me like, oh. It's almost worse munchies than weed. Well, I guess they go hand in hand for me, so I guess I don't really have a good reference point. Thanks for coming in, hi Tess. Great to see you. Heck yeah. We got uh, some quick lash coming up here shortly. If anybody wants to play, just gotta go to jackbox.tv. We'll give you a code and you can come in and make up a name. Is Shepherd's Pie Irish? No. Uh, I would imagine it's. I. I always think of big Irish breakfast when I think of Irish food. I think their food is pretty simple, right? Yeah, tell us. Tell us, farmer. We'll do an Irish episode. Some some lamb shanks.
What's, do you know what an Irish breakfast is? Is that what you're saying? Oh, you got a mouthful, sorry. Help us out, farmer. Help us out, farmer. I think it involves tomatoes and sausages. That's an English breakfast, or yeah, maybe it's the same thing. And uh, beans, big mm. beans. I don't know about beans. Yeah, definitely beans. If it's the same, maybe it's different. We could have Irish breakfast for dinner on the stream. Yeah, farmer will make Irish food. What's the Irish food we should make, farmer? Farmer, farmer where are you? He said the Irish flag is the best gift on the phone. Green hearts. City show. Hi, city show. Spin city the show. wheel. Spin the wheel. We have to be at 40 likes before he's going to spin the wheel again. How many are we at? I think we only pretty much just hit 30. Spin the wheel. Thanks for stopping in, city show. Oh, nice. Farmer, tell us about food. Farmer. Tell us about what food you have that we should make or that What's we... What's a traditional... May Irish. or may not know of. That's Irish, yeah, traditional Irish food. What are you trying to say, Trail Dog? Are you a bevery? Bevery? Bevy? Pointy? Are you? Yes, are you? Are in the space, then BV. BV. And then an arrow pointing right, and then in in uh, parentheses, IE. Are you BV? Are you BV? Bevy? Bevy? Don't forget your bevy. Don't forget your bevy. Farmer, we want to know about Irish foods. Like, what do you have for food? Ask him again. What is a Irish, traditional Irish dish? He doesn't eat. He's Robert's right. Garage is here. Robert's F you, bud. Great to see you. F you, bud. It's a beautiful sign for my bud. It's an F you, bud. Talking about F you. 605 came in too. We love you guys. You were thinking about doing a song for me. I was. I'm pretty sure Robert's Garage would want to hear Money Pussy and Drugs, maybe. That, that could be. Yeah, Owen's a hard working man. He was up so early this morning. I got up to go pee and he was on. And then I went back to bed for like three hours. <laughs> and she got up and he was still on um, working. Yeah, that's true. You can take it to the bank. Oh yeah, I keep screwing that one up. Uh, we are, once we clean up from dinner, I'm going to play a little songy song. And then we're going to play again with Quick Flash and then we're out of here. We got to get out of here. We got to go to bed. It's fine. Don't worry about sleeping all day. We gotta go to bed. Only until 10. <clears throat> Only until 10. And I get up at 6 on my work days, so. And we stayed up until 2 last night. We're like crazy chillin'. Crazy chillin'. We mad chillin', you know? Mad chillin', babe. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Oh my Spuds, cabbage, and bacon porridge for breaky. <laughs> 
Spuds cabbage and bacon porridge. Yeah, savory Ooh. oatmeal is real. That sounds good. We should do that. With potatoes and what was the other thing? Spuds cabbage and bacon cabbage. porridge. That sounds amazing. We're gonna do that. Did you ever put cheese on that? You ever put your can I paint that cheese? Maybe some crumbly sheep cheese. Thanks for coming in, hanging out, everybody. Thanks for uh, giving us a good idea for a rest for a recipe. Farmer's phone's having problems. It's stuck on the big screen. Huh? What the? You're getting viruses from visiting too many corn sites, farmer. Uh oh, farmer. Busted. Farmer, you busted. Look at my apron. Miss Southern Belle got me. It has a sticker of her face on it. Shout out, Miss Southern Belle. We love Miss Southern Belle. She's awesome. She goes on great shopping adventures and she's super sweet and wonderful and supportive. Of all of us crazy YouTubers. Ah, Northern Trail Dog says spuds, cabbage, bacon, mmm, porridge. <laughs> He said pukey face? Uh-huh. Oh, dang. Folk song's always a plus. Yes, yes. Maybe we should bring Chloe three dinners because we're leaving so early. We could she might just, get hungry. We could package up what, what she leaves in her bowl after breakfast. Oh, yeah. Good idea. Uh, excuse me. I'm being rude now. <laughs> Gruder Magruder? Yeah, I'm Gruder Magruder. I like the way City Show really pays attention to these notes. City Show is not, not paying He's attention. taking notes on what's happening around here. He's not, not, he's not, not paying attention. That's for sure. Oh man, I gotta bake those cookies. They, I just know they're a show. Oh yeah, that's true. It may be multiple people. I saw, I do use I throw around the he's and cheese shout more out, than I should. Shout out to the city show. And the whole cast at the city show. The whole city show cast. I'm gonna I'm just gonna bake those cookies right now. I'm just gonna bake them cookies right now. She's gonna bake them cookies. Because we gotta bring some cookies for backpacking tomorrow. It's an important fuel source, you know. Did you switch cameras? Uh, did I? I'm with you. I was going to, and then I'm not sure that I did. Ha ha! Sorry, everyone. I like went. Oh, you know what? I went to, and then and then I showed everybody my apron instead. And then I didn't get high. She didn't get high. She didn't get high. <laughs> it's all Frank's fault because he introduced Farmer to those porno sites. Oh, Frank. Yep, I believe it. He's got all the good ones right here. If you ever need any of that type of thing, don't tell him I sent you. Use code SAD to pay for 10% off. Yeah. But don't know I'm a cent. You know what I mean? So, if you make cookie dough and you want to have extra cookies, you just freeze them on a piece of parchment paper like this. Bada boom, bada bing. And then you can just, now that they're frozen, you can just toss them into a bag and they won't stick together. Toss them right into a bag. Whereas if you toss them into a bag and freeze them, they're going to be all stuck together. Don't forget to stay hydrated, folks. Especially when you're getting ready to go on a backpacking trip. Yeah, camel up. Camel up. If you're trying to be hydrated for an event or a situation, uh, start early. Like days in advance. And just stay hydrated in general and that will take you a long way. Water is good for people. It is so good for people and animals. 
Thanks again for a baggy bag. No way, Jose. Come on. No way. I just need a baggy bag. I don't even have a chat. What's going on? I know. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just dropping in to start these cookies, and then I'm going back in there. Oh. Oh, dropping in is the right way to put it. We're gonna <laughs> just bake that, so it's fine. We're just gonna bake that. Come to Jojo's Bakery, where we just bake that. <laughs> no, I wouldn't do it in my bakery. But if I, if we're eating it, I'd do it. That's part of the appeal of eating at Jojo's Bakery. No, 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 no. <laughs> it may or may not okay. have been on the floor. We have two more dried crab tie meals and uh, one curry. I made a curry. I just have to do the brown rice for it still. I've been doing, when you dehydrate food, it's smart to do it in batches. You do big batches of one thing and then you can use it for different meals. So like you do a big batch of mushrooms or cabbage or carrots and then you can just make it into several different meals. So that's what I've been doing. I learned that tip and it's a hot tip. And I'm going to put that down. She won't put it down. Knives in the sink. That's a hot tip. Okay. Yeah, you gotta warn people when they're nice in the sink. Okay, I'm gonna let you clean up the rest, and All I'm right. gonna play a song for these lovely people. Play a song. I'm gonna play a song. It has a G at the end. It's silent usually, but sometimes you gotta say it. Would you please play them a beautiful song, or maybe one that's not as beautiful but more vulgar? I guess depending on how you're feeling. Huh? Yeah. Oh, oops, wrong one. <laughs> there he is, people. No, I wasn't showing you in there. I was oh. showing your picture. I was showing your funny picture of you hanging on the rock by your dear life. By my dear, dear Wow, beef, sauerkraut, coarse ground beef in a pastry, beef strudel. Yeah, baby. Oh, so he shows putting his mug in the freezer for milk and cookies soon. Oh, yep. Oh, We're that's gonna have those. Those are a oatmeal, peanut butter, chocolate chip cookie. Yum. There's a oh, farmer's laptop doesn't have Irish flags. What? What? Is that Irish Northern Trail Dog? I think Frank deleted them. Beef strudel. That sounds amazing. Standard wax paper. Check. Kathy said, cool, sad, perfect cast iron cleaning rag you got oh there. Oh my goodness, Kathy H. Kathy made us that, and it is the first, no we've bucks. already gone through one, like it had a ton of holes in and it. And by not already, by like after yeah, two, already. <laughs> two, two years, two of, years use. of use of like pretty much every day using every it. Every day, yeah. We use that thing, yeah. It's amazing. Thank you so much, Kathy. We still have another one in backup for two years from now or however long. Best cast iron scrubber in the land. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Custom creation. I can see that picture of sad really big right here. I'm gonna I'm gonna sink to it. Oh. They're gonna sing about throwing me off to the highest mountain top. Mm -mm. <laughs> you gonna toss me off the mountain top? No.
brought me back from being too far gone. Your ass smooth as Tennessee whiskey. Your ass sweet as strawberry wine. Your ass warm as a glass of brandy. Honey, I stay stoned on your love all the time Used to look for love in all the same old places Found the bottom of the bottle always dry But when you poured out your heart I didn't waste it Cause honey there's nothing like your love to get me high You're as smooth as Tennessee whiskey You're as sweet as strawberry wine You're as warm as a glass of brandy Honey, I stay stoned on your love all the time. Ow. It's true. I do. I'm the luckiest man alive. Uh, Sorry, everybody. City Show set a timer for Cookie's three songs. Cookie? Yeah, yeah, that's about right. <laughs> Oh, we need a warning. Some people oh. wonder, oh, no. do I oh. play cause there's music in my soul? Oh shoot. Does it make my heart glow? Do the melodies just flow? Or is it something that makes my spirit grow? I say no, I don't do it. Most kids. I don't do it for the love. I don't do it for the hugs. I do it for the money, pussy, and drugs. Oh, she does. A day or two ago, a girl came to my show. She said, I really dig your music, don't you? I don't do it for the love. I don't do it for the hug.
get a major dill hole disclaimer, shout out? Disclaimer, disclaimer. Yeah, we need a major dill hole. Shout Reporting out. major dill hole. That was a dill hole request. The band is Mountain Sprout. He originally, uh, so to be fair, he originally requested to be 50. Huh? To be fair. To be fair. He originally requested a song called 57 Chevy, and it is very explicitly like pornographic. And it, I was like, um, it makes can that we, song look tame. Can we reach a middle? Like maybe someday I might do that, but <laughs> she does it for tapir worms. <laughs> For the tapir worms, or wait, for the money to peer worms and drugs. Oh, that sounds good. Uh, Sad's an angel and JoJo don't give a shit. <laughs> yeah, shout out to Joe. Number one hit. <laughs> shout out to Dill Hole. Big up to Dill Hole. I also do a cover called I Like Meth. Shout out MC Frosty. Shout out MC Frosty. Who wrote that song. We don't really like that, but it's no. a great song. I mean, we don't like, well, it's an, I mean, he said it himself. It's an anti-meth song. It says meth brings death. And it's coming real soon. I mean, he did, he does, he has he been did. known to partake. I think that was just his character. Yeah, maybe. That was just but the song is very much an anti-meth song. What would be WWBD? Mm -hmm. WWBD. Good question. Listen to some groovy tunes and we smoke a J. There's a timer on the cookies. I got a timer on the cookies. Cookie timer. They're, because they're frozen, they take a little bit longer. They normally take 14 minutes, but I give them 19 when they're coming straight from the freezer. So they still have seven minutes left, but thank you, City Show. We've had chat save us many times from burning things and stuff. I'll, I'll give him a little rotate. Check on him. Chat, chat knows what's up. And if they don't, at least they'll make me laugh. Yeah, exactly. You can't beat that. Only seven more likes until we do another spin of the wheel. I just got chocolate on Kathy's. Oh, I got it all over it. What'd you do? On this, on Kathy's pot holder. I'm usually so good about being careful with it. Jojo. But I got, I got chocolate smears all over it. It'll wash right out. Yeah, it will. Show us the other cute side while you're at it. Okay. So okay. it's real cute. It is so cute. Oh, we love our furry friends. Cuddle time. Shout out. Farmer Shady. F -f 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 Farmer Shady. Farmer's got us figured out. Sounds a sweetheart. Jojo, don't give a shit. Jojo. Ooh, did we see our coffee is like full? Look at it. Jojo's a sweetheart. Look Sweet at our coffee. Hearts. I don't, yeah, those things aren't mutual exclusive. Mutually exclusive. Shout you can out. be a sweetheart and Shout not give a shit. Wait, you just said that there? We'll check in on Toddy every once in a while. Okay. Is that good? Yeah. Good spot for Toddy. Perfect. Shout out Toddy. I need to fill up my water. Ooh. Oh. I'm glad that wasn't very full. I would have spilled Ooh. it. Ooh. Ooh. We're excited for our trip in case yeah. we haven't said that. We really are. It's going to be awesome. We're going to do like 20 miles in the next two days. Right. From here all the way up to here. Yeah. Woo. And back again. And back. And back. back. And Burke. And Burke. Toddy rocks. I saw uh, Todd and Jose hanging out today. Never thought I'd see that. Are you guys on a bacon high? We are riding the bacon high. Big time, and that watermelon salad. That We're watermelon high on all that stuff. So there's a thing if you We're live high in on the, it all, Glenn. There's a thing if you live in the Northwest called Hermiston watermelons. They're the best, sweetest, most delicious 
sugar-filled watermelons in the land. If you ever see Hermiston watermelons and it's a Hermiston watermelon, you will want to pick that up. Did High Touch say any blondes here yet? I don't know, Farmer might be blonde. Are you blonde, Farmer? <laughs> Thanks, Greg. Yeah, we're eventually we're going to do from 1 all the way to 12 here. <clears throat> We might do this depending on how Jojo and I feel, but we're, we're at least doing 1 to 12. But this week we're going to do 11 to 5, and then there's a little loop-de up to a hut, and we're going to check that out. So we're going to have great views of the mountain and lots of wild wilderness to document for everybody to check out. Yeah, Super it's gonna be awesome. I just love it. It feels so great to be out there. And it's like, it's not the peak day of the meteor shower, but it's going to be banging meteors. We have an alarm set for 1 a.m. Banging meteors. I'm so excited. <laughs> Salmon, we we need to go hang out at Punchbowl. Oh, sometime. is that right now? I don't, I know. I think it's past, but they yeah, oh. Punchbowl. They jump up that giant waterfall. Cool. Yeah. Uh, Kangaroo Island used to love hiking to remote trout streams in Colorado. That's cool. Did you fish when you hiked there? I would imagine maybe, or just looked at the 
Oh, uh, of course, Kathy. I remember. It's so funny because I remembered. Uh, I was like, oh, Kathy asked about that song too. You said one or the other, but I was gonna play them both, and then I got distracted. I think they're done, but they look a little greasy. You wanna let me show you on the camera? Wait, what are we talking about? The cookies. Oh, are they like brown on top? I kind of want to make sure that they're good and. You wanna look at them? They look pretty. I gotta look at them in real life. Mm. I think maybe they could use another. Two more. Three. Three. Yep. Three more. Check. Thank you, Chef. You're welcome. Thank you. So King Ryland used to pack in a lightweight fly rod, catch and release, of course. That's cool. I would love though to catch and eat it if I knew I could eat I'm allergic to fish. Robot and he said that must be the spot the bears go fishing. Uh robot. We're, do black bears do that? We almost I was I wouldn't I mean, see right now. I it's just it's so weird because I always see that like grizzly bear in my mind. Fishing, you know, catching the salmon, jumping in the river. And we don't have grizzlies around here, we just have black bears, but maybe. I saw my first little black bear cub uh, robot. Yeah. Just on, on our last hiking, backpacking trip. Oh, I'm looking up here. Yeah, Check. if you want to talk to somebody. Robot! <laughs> yeah, he didn't, I didn't get to see it because I was behind. I, and all as I saw in honesty was there was like, all the trees were burnt where we were. So it was like basically a black ball just descended a burnt tree, like in, a, in the speed of light, just like boom. And it was just like this little, you know, little, but like about that big of a black ball and then it was out. Okay. But that was a cool experience. Yeah, I bet. I was jealous. Okay, back I'm taking it back. Uh, thank you so much, Kathy. It's really, it's been so much fun writing music. I just can't even. Oh, dang it. Northern Trail Dog is doing some uh, scuffing with the storm moving in. Farmer asked how long I took to play the ukulele and if I'm still, still self-taught. Yeah, so Farmer, I, it took me like three weeks. I think I had three weeks to learn happy birthday for a friend's birthday, for a friend of that time's birthday. And I, <laughs> I, so I had to learn three chords for Happy Birthday, and it was the first song I learned. And that was the hardest part, is just like getting your fingers to do what you need to do. Sad handed me our little, oh, it's upstairs now in my studio that Sad set me up. Uh, our little just like token cheap ukulele that our friend had, a, a band sign. And uh, yeah, so I learned those three chords and that song in... I think it was three weeks I had, and I mean, I was still definitely real rough at it. And yeah, I took, I had uh, two lessons, two online lessons, and then I just kind of felt like it was, I mean, he was just giving me suggestions of songs to learn because they had different chords in them. And not really, and like, he definitely, he gave me a couple little tips, but I'm like, I can just learn all this on YouTube videos, you know, so I quit doing and that was like after about a year, so I already knew quite, like all the basic chords, kinda. And so yeah, I've been, it'll be three years that I've been playing in, at the end of September. So I've almost been playing three years now. And yeah, totally all the way, all the way self-taught, all the way. Except those two lessons that, which is, which is why I learned, um, Neon Rose was those lessons. Malikai, Malikai, what are they feeding you? Malikai, Malikai, it's not your fault. They won't take you to the vet. You're obviously not their favorite
a couple more times. Smelly cat, smelly cat, what are they feeding you? Smelly cat, smelly cat, it's not your fault. Smelly cat, smelly cat, what are they feeding you? Smelly cat, smelly cat, it's not your fault.
to give you strength when your soul is bare. Someone to let you know when your dress is caught up in your underwear. Who 
farted? Who farted? Who farted? Dragon, cheers. Double blink. Remember skis. when I thought Sad did earlier because he was making some kind of noise on the counter? <laughs> yeah. Oh, good. I'm glad. It's always it's always touchy when new people come. <laughs> <laughs> You've been here before, though. This guy, yeah, this, this will make but, or break a view. <laughs> you, sometimes, I mean, we do go long periods of time without saying stuff like that, but we're all about that, or I at least am all about that kind of stuff. Sad's, Sad's just a sweetheart. I'm just a sweetheart. He's just guys. a gosh darn sweetheart. <laughs> I'm just an edited demon like all of you. <laughs> I play a good sweetheart. Though. Yeah, what Kathy H said. We're great all, to see you, We're Dragon. all great people on the inside. We all have it in us to be That's great, true, amazing people. We do. It's we all inside start. of us all. Okay, let's give uh But you 30, can still say all those things. 30 seconds? 30 seconds to get in here. Get 30 in seconds, in. one more spot. If you want, if you don't want to play, but you want to get in the... What are you laughing Nothing. You want to get in the audience, you can do that. Once we start the game, if you hop in, you'll be in the audience. And you can vote on your favorite answer, but you don't have to have the pressure of answering any questions. No questions, no pressure. Is it really hot down there too, Dragon? Hey, LT! Great to see you. Thanks for coming Welcome. in. Welcome! We're about to get this game. We're about to get game. a little bit inappropriate. We're about to get inappropriate. <laughs> People are showing their penises. Oh my uh, my you know, penis is on the board. You're wondering who farted. You know, not too hot. Nice. We haven't been until now. Now it's really hot. It's supposed to be in the hundreds. It was yesterday. It's supposed to be for the next couple days. Nice, LT, yes. One last chance. So if you anybody wants seconds. to get in, you gotta go to jackbox.tv, enter J-W-Y-M. The black flag has been woven. Woven? That should be the... Oh, Debeige, De you made it! Debeige loves Quiplash. This is perfect. <laughs> exactly. Yep, we went out earlier in the day and got the There, Schmitty here. You there, Schmitty here. Yes. Remember, guys, during this game, it's natural to fall in love with me. Fight the feeling. Let's go. Remember, anyone who wants to join the audience can do so at any time by logging in with the room code. This is round one. You'll get two prompts on your device. Just answer them however you want. Your responses, or quips, will be pitted against someone else's, and everyone will vote on their favorite. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! It's hot in Florida, too. Yeah, it's like always hot there, I bet it's... If it's extra hot, that's crazy. You have two answers. Yeah, that's to yell during church. <laughs> okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. A bad thing to yell during church. The devil's after me, Willie. <laughs> the devil's after me, Willie. The like, devil's after me, Willie. <laughs> oh. Or, I love TJ. <laughs> <laughs> Tuesday. 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 Tues
Next one, a street name you never see. It's voting time. A street name you'll never see. Wet pussy leg. We can't say that ass. <laughs> you can say one about the other. Ten seconds to vote. Don't forget to vote. It's a big part of the game. If you don't vote, that's okay. Yeah. <laughs> Next up, a movie that should never be made into a theme park ride. Time to vote. A movie that should never be made into a theme park ride. Jurassic Park. Just type in something dirty. And next, helpful advice you would give to Super Mario. Vote on your devices. It's jump higher. Or jump asshole. It's so funny how often people Mind melt. Greeting stalls blues. Stalls red sends his regards. Thanks for coming in. Great to see you. Don't forget to vote, everybody. Vote, vote, vote. Vote, vote, vote. Vote, vote, vote. Make it tasty. Stalls the freaking greeting. I mean, how how I like how I choose. How do you feel? Why are Coming up next, the real yeah, reason the dinosaurs died. Our, uh, it's voting the real time. Reason the dinosaurs died. They overdosed <laughs> on weed, man. Or they ate their own poop, man. He called the poop. He called the shit poop. <laughs> Never eat or you shit, man. Never shit or you eat either. Five seconds to vote. Don't forget to vote, vote, vote. Okay, next one. A sign you probably shouldn't put up in your yard. Next in line, <laughs> what robots dream about. Time to vote. What robots dream about? Fast cars, ladies, and fine meals. Also, what robots dream about? Thrusting plugs and wires, if you know what I mean. Thrusting plugs. Glad you made it, stalls. We're going to quit after this. That's all for round one. Here's the scoreboard. Who's not in the lead? We're going to get four in the morning like Stalls Blues does like every day. And we're going to... Oh! Jojo, Charles, Charmer. 
Now oh, round no, two, no, where no, all no, points no, and bonuses uh, are doubled. Guys, the drama. You, we did a, We did a sad backpack review too earlier. Oh. If you did want to go back and check that out. Two questions. Smug, we'll show you after this. We'll show you where we're going before we quit. The first prompt is using only two words, a new state motto for Texas. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Stop wanking. Or move here. Stop wanking. Wank here. That's the new state motto for Texas. Wanking here. <laughs> you gotta say it all. A girl like that. Wank in the air. Wank in the air. Move here. Move here. Move here. Our first quick flash. Charmer. Uh -huh. <laughs> 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 And next, something you rarely see used as a car decoration. Something rarely it's voting see used time. As a car decoration. Used condoms or a bloody tampon. Ew. Those, man, those are similar, real similar. If you plan it right, you can use one to hold the other and then tie it in a knot. Hey, a proper review, baby. Whoop, whoop. Don't forget to vote. Vote, vote, vote. Ooh. Two good ones. Dang, you guys can't even go play. Only thing that could be Exactly. Flashlight scrotum jack. Okay, next one. A bad name for a brand of bottled water. Vote on your devices. <laughs> You got this. You got this. 15 seconds, don't forget to vote. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, Stalls has a space arm pick. What's that like? Deuce, one. Four, three, two, one, vote. Who farted? Oh, good one, who farted? 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 Next up, the best pickup line for an elderly singles mixer. Coming up next, the name of a hairstyle that will never catch on. <laughs> it's voting time. The farmer is style. Or the curly pussy. Oh my gosh, how do you pick one? Could you give me the curly pussy? <laughs> Could you give me the farmer's style, please? I think that's high in the middle. Uh, ho, 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 ho. I think I might have had the curly pussy before, so I
Next one. A new word for people that drive too slow in the fast lane. Time to vote. A new word for people that drive too slow in the fast lane. Turtle heads. Or leechman slugs. Turtle heads or leechman slugs. I'm going to use one of those for sure, I think. On uh, Stall's Planet, they say, suck my space pit. And on Weep Shaw's Planet, they say, put him on Google and I'll Google about Facebook. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's You're really, you're And next is, <laughs> everything yeah. tastes better yeah. with blank. I'm not in the gutter. I'm not thinking about that. I'm not playing. Everything tastes better with blank. Yeah. Coming up next. Oh, it's voting time. Sexy turtle. Pussy money and drugs. Or Wahoo, yes. Shout out Guru and Wahoo the turtle. I had a pet turtle when I was a kid. And I named it Sad to Fear. <laughs> he named it his name. I said, I said, what is it? I I mean, why? Shout out. Round two is now complete. Let's see who completed it well. <laughs> and now round three, the last lash. Point values are tripled, and you'll all be answering the same prompt this time. Our last lash prompt is an Olympic sport that never made it synchronized blank. You get three votes this round to spread votes. out any way you like, or give them all to one answer. Oh, no. An Olympic sport that never made it. Synchronized choo-choo race? Choo-choo. Coochie race? Coochie. Oh, shout out all the mechanics. Synchronized douching? Synchronized masturbation? Synchronized testicle twisting? Synchronized farting and masturbating? Synchronized wanking or synchronized hopscotch. <laughs> I'm the 
big wiener. <laughs> are the big vas upper vascular. That's the end. Let's see the final yeah. scoreboard. Yeah. Oh, oh, no. We gotta go to bed like now. I already quit drinking coffee and that's unheard of. Here's where we're going, everybody. Here's where we're going. So this is the Timberline and Trail, which goes all the way up around Mount Hood. There we are. And we are going to do... So the m mountain is in the center of this trail. That's the peak of the mountain. Yep. So in September, we're going to do from the Timberline Trail to Cloud Cap. So we're doing a little recon tomorrow, and we're going to go from Cloud Cap, number 11 there, and we're going to go all the way to number 5, and then we're going to have to zoom in to show you. We're going to do this little loop D right here. We're going to go check out a shelter that's down this loop. We're going to climb up this point. Yep. And then and there's the, a shelter and then, here. And then go back up to the trail head back and, and we're, we're yeah we're gonna camp I mean we're not sure I mean that's the plan you never know right like it might be too much we might end up stopping and camping. I might get here and be like yep I'm done which it's seven miles to there um right uh let's see oh cove and that's supposed to be like the coolest spot to camp so part of us kind of wants to go all the way and come back to there and just have uh, less to do on Wednesday morning. Six, six-ish. Yeah, Jesse would have made you call your mama farmer. So nine up. Man, I hope that, for prayers for the little froggy. We'll see how hot it is. Uh, this is where... Oh, John was who, f who farted. Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> nice. That was fun. Shout Thanks for filling it up, everybody. That was great. This is where we went up to Dollar Lake and camped last time. It was off of this trail. Stalls knows our secret from a reflection in your glasses. Uh-oh. He knows Oh, yeah. Our, our very first backpacking he, trip last year. He knows our year. booty hole code. Yeah. Our booty hole code's been busted. <laughs> we did a VOD for it. Our booty hole our code VOD? Vlog. What vlog. Is it? We did a vlog for it. It was our first backpacking vlog. Uh, yeah, we went up. We could go. I mean, we're, we went on part of the trail that we're going to be hiking on tomorrow. But just a short part of it. Because we came from over by Red Hill, right? Or wait, where did we come from? Uh, when we came up, mm -hmm. we came up by the chemical, I think. Oh, okay, yep, yep. Or over here, maybe. I think we did do, like, yeah, right from there. over, yep, right over there. Yeah, yep. yeah, we came up this line. And then right we walked here. a little section. And then the we cut chemical. over here. And then we went up here. And then oh. the lake's right. Wait, the lake's over there. Yeah. So we tried to go up to Barrett Spur and we failed. We were like got, over zealous our first trip. We got to about right here and we were like, okay, no. We don't need, or I was like, nope, I don't need to go any farther. Oh, Greasy said he, be careful camping around that area. He hears the lodge was built on an Indian burial ground. Did you? Timberline Lodge. We're not going to be camping by the lodge. It's going to be like far from the lodge. But when we do our backpacking trip later in September, we're going to start there and we're going to leave our car there. Our car might get haunted. 
Well, we're glad she did that week because we like having you around. Yeah, this is where Barrack Spur beat me. It was a beautiful view. But it's cool because, so, we camped right here and we could see Elk Cove. We had a nice, like, overview of Elk Cove. And now we'll be able to camp down in the Elk Cove, hopefully, maybe. Yeah, I don't know about that. I really feel like I want to do back-to-back -back longer. Like, I want to do 2 to 10 miles because that's what we're going to be, or something similar to that. Because when we do our three-day, two-night, we're going to be doing 10, 10, and 7. So I'd really like to see how, rather than setting ourselves up for a shorter hike the next day, how we'll do doing two long days. Okay. But I mean, we still, you know, we're still totally open. We'll play it by ear. We'll do what we feel. Yeah, we'll feel what we do. We'll do what we feel. Yeah. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Thanks, <gasps> 40. Oh. Yeah, team. Spin the wheel. One more Spin for the, the road. Wheel. Spin Frick, yeah. the wheel. You guys rock. Spin Thank the you all wheel. so much. Spin the wheel. No gummy. You didn't even chant with me. I'm sorry, I forgot. I was too... Go. <laughs> That's too uh, focused. Gravity Bomb Finale! Show's over! Show's He's over! He's out the wheel! The wheel! The wheel! Wheel! I've never seen it, I've never seen it spelled like that, but it really does sound like that. Wheel. Q's like got so much you <laughs> and Buckley, it's like a Q D. You know, when you're totally open, you're totally open. Oh, 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 that was close. You gotta have the legs and everything. Okay, we love you guys. Hit the gravity bomb. Yes, T's just in time. T, we're gonna go hiking tomorrow. We're gonna up at four in the morning. We're gonna hike 20 miles. This one's for T. Yeah, Greasy, I like it. That's how I'm gonna see it in my head when I say it from now on. Quill. Oh, thanks, Kathy. Yeah, quill, quill. Thank you Queel. so much. Yeah, T. It's gonna be exciting. It's uh, I think it's gonna be like a couple thousand feet of el or like three thousand feet of elevation is what we were thinking about total. And yeah, we're gonna do some little creek crossings. We're gonna filter our water. We're gonna do our first homemade backpacking meal pad thai. I mean, is we're excited. We're super excited. Chloe's excited. She's been resting up today for the trip tomorrow, so it's great. This one goes out to you guys. Jojo. Take boot breaks. Boot. We both wear running shoes when we hike. And we're going to take lots of breaks. And we're going to take, see, so we used to be so gung-ho and weird about it, you know, like we just wanted to get it done and we would, and that's something that we're learning from our last trip. I feel like we really learned that taking and breaks is important. Like lunchtime, we took that's our shoes off, smuggler. Yes. let them dry out completely. Got our feet wet twice. Drink the milk. <laughs> Drink the milk to your face. Drink the milk. You always have great advice, Smug. Thanks. While I do this, do you want to give some shout outs to our amazing, yes. our amazing, uh, TCFC. TCFC. We love you, TCFC. This is, these are the newest members. If oh. you want to give them a big ups. Our newest members. I didn't even see that Dilbo became a member. Oh yeah, he was gifted a membership by Kathy. By Kathy H. So, and then Kangaroo Island TV joined tonight. Thank you so much. And also, what made us realize that we should not rinse our basil. Duh. Duh. Uh, definitely check out that channel too. Both of those channels are amazing channels. Dutchman. Shout out Dutchman. Golden Cub. Big new up, as of last week. Wolfles, Trixie, Greasy Strangler, put out those, put out those fun emojis, people. Yeah, Kathy H. I see your emojis. Trisha, aka Madness, Fan Life with Gina. Shout she out rocks. Gina. People, people. He's so stuck. He looks like sad looks. Detroit, Michigan. Big ups, Detroit. Yeah, Detroit gifted a bunch when big, he first big, came big, in. Big, that big, was big, amazing. Big Smuggler the Snuggler. Big. Charles Richardson. 
Taro. Sunshine, New York. Big up. Stars Blue. Stars Blue. John! John! Gifted five sacks of your membership. What? 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 Oh, what? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hump that rock. Hump that rock. What, John? Thank you so much. Thank you so much, John. Huge. Huge. Inherited stitches. Yeah, trolls, trolls will steal your left socks. I love the way it was like a 
nice restart and then everybody filled it up so great. It was awesome. We love you guys. Ooh, Fruit Loops took its first puff, up, puff off his new crop. That's exciting. Happy harvest. Yeah, yeah T, we're going to be doing a, a VOD on it, not a vlog on it, not this. So this week is going to be Huckleberry Pickin'. Next week is going to be our grand adventure with Wheat and Shaw, which was amazing and fun and hilarious. And then the week after that will be this backpacking trip. But we'll tell you guys all about it next Monday. We're looking real forward to it. You know how I like to spoiler alert every time we do something. Here, here's, here's a preview of next week's... Uh, a preview. Uh... Chloe's goat cheese face. <laughs> she here licked next her nose. That would be weird to be able to lick your nose, wouldn't it? Be here next week for nose licking good times. Well, three weeks from now. Or, oh, it is next week. Mm. I'm done. Be here this week. Be here this Wednesday at 5 PST. 5.30. I, I don't know what I'm talking about. Unless you know something I don't. But we're going to be getting slow back from the mountain. Slow mo. Yeah, I might. Who knows? Slow mo. Oh, yeah. That's going to be. We're going to be hiking out. We could even just be getting home. We're probably just going to be getting home. Yeah, if we're going to be doing a longer hike. If we're not here at the premiere, don't contact the authorities. But if we're not here for Monday's live, maybe contact the authorities. Do it for sure. We'll be here. We'll be here on Wednesday, though. <laughs> yeah, it's true. And we can't we wait to see you guys. We love you guys so much. Uh, thank John you, Singer. thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. T, I'm uh, so glad you made it. Stalls Blues made it, too. Kathy rocks. Farmer's been hanging tough. Big time. Love it. Dutchman's yeah. been hanging tough. Smuggler you guys are so it. great. Greasy made it. Robert's We're going to make it. In here. Robert's been up in here. Don't forget. Anyone that we didn't say, we love you. And we're so glad that you spend a little bit of your time with us. Or any amount of time at all. We're flattered and so grateful. We're half an hour past our deadline. Don't forget. Do something Always you remember. love. Always remember. Always remember. Do something you love. With someone you love. Even if it's by yourself. Because you got to love yourself first. And we love you guys. So just know that. And we're going to end the stream after a message from your sponsor.